was disposed of in the way by 30th april yes it seems that the time was given but not have been disposed of that for three months the time is short about just a for the three months time is grant a uh, requested one uh produce the report of the district and sessions for a judge gandhinagar uh no i may look your principal senior civil judge gandhinagar later dated 2nd may 2022 further period of 3 months time is granted to dispose of the lar Three, three months is granted as requested by the learned judge. Six is disposed. Yes. Mr. Thakur. Puja Ashram is there. No, no, but Mr. Shailesh Thakur was appeared. Is Achha. on leave. He is on leave. He is on leave. Uh, we two are combined jointly up to this matter. So you are seeking time. I would be requesting for time, but the uh, petitioner, the revisionist advocate, has some objection. He has requested mm -hmm. the matter to be called. 
let it be called out then why are you mentioning the word i am mentioning this you mention it by saying that you want to Sir, I am sorry to interrupt. Sir, number three, mm -hmm. I will be appearing with Mr. Shah in this matter for the petition. Yes. yes, she wants time because I, of the. Sir, there is as such he would never object. But the only difficulty is that it's Order Seven, Rule Eleven, and the trial court has kept the matter for the hearing of Exhibit Five on the eighth of July. Eighth of July. Yes. See, I can do one thing. Yes, I can uh, give you the uh, give this on. 30th of June, subject to a lot of not that I can give you time on uh, 20 July and you can take one agenda. I don't, I will take an agenda and they may not object. To no, it. no, I will say the trial court will accordingly grant very well. The lot of can just at the request of uh, Miss Pooja K. Asha, item three Malaki is uh, SO2. We'll keep it on 20 July. Two zero July. Uh, in the meanwhile, the learned advocates in the matter may move an appropriate application before the learned trial court on the next date of hearing, seeking an adjournment, which may be considered favorably by the trial court, pending the present civil revision application. I am grateful. Yes. Here, apply. Here, request for some time. Well, it is yet to be called out. First, we just have the first Yes, now 12. May request for some time. At the request of Mr. Kapadia, SOP. <coughs> this will go or again 2021. 21st of July. Okay. <coughs> uh, for the matter, season number 24. There is a CA for additional evidence filed in this matter. 24. Yeah. It is before the lawsuit directed the registry to tag the application with the main first appeal. 740. But uh, orders will have to be passed in all that. These are LAR. Please watch. So are these admitted? Please watch. Yes, sir. All these first appeals are admitted? I just who is appearing, Mr. Onward, or Mr. Ms. Patel, who is appearing in item 24 onwards? No, up to 20, uh, up to 27, I am appearing, and uh, 28 to 30. Uh, she is up. Yes. No, in these matters, he is saying some application for additional evidence is to be uh, brought mm -hmm. on record. Yes. But are these appeals admitted? Yes. What yes. orders have to be passed? Yes. These are all LARs. Yes, sir. Please be very you have the papers. Have what is the last order? Mm -hmm. Give that uh, mm -hmm. uh, brief them. Mm -hmm. 24 cups. You will otherwise pass an order and distribute it off. In the sense that if it is to be admitted, admitted, and your application will be heard along with the first appeal. Application is there, though not on board. Okay, last time Mr. Nikun Rawal was on leave. So you were on leave last time. These will have to be admitted, I think. <coughs> ah, that's what yeah, I am saying. Yes. We will admit it and your application for additional evidence will be heard at the time of final year. Please. Right? Or if, or if the case, let the matter be called out. Before it matter be called out at that time, I just query from Mr. Rabat on this one. Easy. All right, sir. Fill in the 14 matters. 14. 14. 14. Here, me and Mr. Akshat 20 requesting for first week of July. First week is not possible. And second week, my lord. <coughs> Two zero onwards only. Two yes, zero July 20, onwards. Twenty because in this matter also. Keep it on twenty second of July. Because in uh, this matter also, Mr. Nwala. Yes, one matter of Mr. Nwala is kept at twenty eight. So this matter may be kept on twenty eight also. Two zero. 
I am grateful to my host. At the request of learned counsel for the respondent by consent, right? Joint request. Joint request. That's the joint request of the party. The SO two twenty seven two zero. Grateful to my host. Okay, so. Hello, CA number four. Which four? Now, now we are. I think after the board is. Oh. CA number forty-two, forty-nine. Serial number forty-two, forty-nine. Sixty-two, sixty-nine. Sixty-two, sixty-eight. Serial number sixty-eight. Me and Mr. Gambatulo are requesting some time. At the joint request of the learned council for the parties, S O two, let this go on twenty ninth of no. Twenty ninth of July. Very well. Very. I'm okay. Zero number sixty nine to thirty seven. Seven. In view of the leave note filed by Mr. Ankit Mehta, it is too short now. It will go around that time. Twenty-six seven. Twenty-six seven. Seventy eight. Seventy eight. Other side is filed. Yes, Mr. Mahavir Gadwe. In view of the six note. In view of the six note filed by Mr. Mahavir Gadwe. No, Monday to not possible. We'll go for twenty seventh of July. No, it's all full. Every day there are two hundred plus matters. So. Okay. Twenty seventh. Eighty six. Yes. It is reflected. In view of the leave note. Uh, filed by Mr. Nolik J. Shailar. So to twenty seventh. You heard it right now. Twenty seventh. What's up? Serial number seventy nine. We have Mr. Bansali. Uh, with concert, I request. Seventy nine. Yes. With concert, I requesting the matter may be adjourned and IR may be extended. Seventy nine. You are Mr. Bansali. Mr. Bansali. Uh, By consent, yes. Uh, by consent, SO two twenty eight seven. IR may be extended. Interim relief is extended till the next date of year. Yes, I'll do this. Eighty one. I am for Mr. Esan Prajapati. Here, with consent, I am requesting for time two or three weeks time may be granted. Eighty one. Eighty one. But by consent, yes, with consent. By consent, SO two at least, uh, please. Serial number eighty seven to ninety. Yes. Okay. Whatever the reason, by consent. No, but it will be on twenty eighth. Twenty eighth of July. Uh, IR is extended till then. IR is extended till then. This was just a one, Mr. Tolia. This was five zero, nine zero, twenty eight, twenty eight seven. Twenty eight You are Mr. Mr. Nar Mehta, learned advocate for the applicant, submits that the clients have taken on the case papers and no objection from him in the month of the last month. in May. And the note to the to that effect is also filed in the registry. However, his name is shown today as no 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 one has filed appearance on behalf of the applicants. So to
Mentioning on behalf of Mr. Prajapati with joint request, I am requesting for some time. And the joint request of the council for the parties. So, serial number 98. Just a moment. 26. Yes. Serial number 98, Lordship. Mentioning on behalf of Mr. Popert, requesting for some accommodation. We have not have received paper book yet. Side? No, Lordship, but I will. Let it be called out. Otherwise, you pick comes. Very no well. One sided mention. Very well, Lordship. It will, it will be considered, but inform the other side. Very well. Lordship. 99. 99. 99. May I request for next week or a week thereafter? I have consented, but it's not before 20. Yeah. Please, my lord. Subject to my lord's convenience. Yes, we can keep it on 20 seconds. Of my Great. Consent, 20 seconds. 99. Huh? 90. Uh, obliged. 20 seconds. Of Shifted. You are Mr. Prera Koda. Mr. Preda Goja, learned advocate for the applicant, submits that the endorsement on, on the first returnable date today, the endorsement shows that respondent number one is unserved as he has shifted to another place. He prays for some time to furnish new address of the respondent number one. Full stop. Time granted, SO2. How much time you require? Because it will have to. 22nd July. Lordship 105 with consent. I am requesting for time, two or three weeks time, maybe. With the consent of the parties, the other consent for the parties, SOP. 287. Please. Office endorsement shows that uh, notice has not been received back with respect to respondent number one. Public service SO2 29. The yes. proof of the matter wherein it is covered by the judgment of this court that the RMP is not called for. If it is required, what is the call for the time being? And by that time, I'll attend my friend reading for everything for me. 114 also is there? No. No, no, no. 121 is 120. Sorry. Yes. Just write that. Uh, The Learned Council for the appellant submits that uh, proceedings are necessary for the disposal of the plan. First appeal, full stop. Accordingly, the Learned Trial Court is directed to transmit the record and proceedings along with the paper books before the next date of hearing. So, 4th of August. That RNT is not required, but uh, let it go on 4th of August. No, no, let it go for 4th of August. Let the trial court also transmit. Please. 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 Yes. These are the group of two villages. Eric also is covered by the liaison report. And also covered by the first court, which has been accepted. RNP is not received. That the RNP is received. received and so simply it may be kept on 6th or 7th of July. 6th and 7th of July? Yes. That may not be possible. Your RNP is received. Right. For any date, of July. This is covered by this court judgment. Yes, court, uh, this court. Same village. 
no, not same village, adjacent village. It is uh, the judgment of the Unja village, which has been confirmed up to the Honorable Supreme Court, which has been relied upon. So this can be disposed of or if it can be kept earlier. Subject to your lot. Let this go on 19th, 19th of July. Yes. This is also covered. This can be covered. RNP is received. 127. Seven. We'll keep it all on that day so that it can be finished off on the okay. same day. 197. Otherwise, it will come. 197. Uh, or 18 or 17. Also, all matters will come on the same date. It will not be possible. So, you can bat accordingly and finish off all the. <coughs> <laughs> I leave it to you. One day international, you can play. <laughs> Let it be 19. Though. Last one is one. Just a moment. Just a moment. Man. One take one one twenty seven ka bhi nineteen seven. Serial number one twenty. One twenty. This matter about hmm. who are and is required. Reason is this board. Okay. There are eight groups of same village which has been disposed of by the division bench of this report. This was left out because it was before the legislation. So state way this can be disposed of. Okay. <laughs> it is for the same village. It the is same, a... everything is same. This was left out because it was uh, not listed before the We'll keep it on fifth. Five yes. seven. Please. You were mentioning one. I'm requesting for seven zero. Okay, just so we'll finish the board. Yes. But serial number seven zero and. Maybe just a moment. We'll he'll call out the board after that. You mentioned. Please, I'm sorry. Yes. Now, now serial number seventy and seven one. In this matter, Mr. Ankit Mehta has filed a leave not. He just uh, mentioned. Yes, I'm not aware. He just mentioned 26 7. Please. Yes. Both matter. Uh, yes, both the matter. Both the matter. Please, yes. because 26 I'm told, 7. I'm, I would, he he told us that he has informed you. Please, please. Yes. And in view of the leave note only. Yes, yes. I'm yes. obliged. 33. This is a leave note of Mr. Harshit Karathia. So we will just uh, adjourn it in view of the leave note filed by Mr. Karathia 297. Yes. And for that, it will go to 20. Yeah. You can have it on 29th. Please, that would be a very mentioned. So, the serial number 5 is on 5. So, you have the party that's central. I also place one set on the next You have placed it on this one. Yes, just give that file. Uh, we'll do that. Yes. Uh, Mr. Jaimina, the learned advocate for the applicant, has placed on record the consent terms. Consent terms dated 28 January 2022. Full stop. Uh, whereby the parties have settled the matter. Full stop. In view of the settlement between the parties, the 
present civil revision application is disposed of accordingly. In fact, just because of this application, that board was not permitted to withdraw the suit. If suit was permitted to withdraw, it would have become चलो <laughs> तो तो हाउ मच टाइम यू वो इलेक्ट्रॉनिक अठवाड़िया नंबर ने आप हां यस मैम यू आर मिस्टर वेश आई एम आई एम वेश मिस्टर एस एल वेश एल अनर एडवोकेट फॉर द एप्लीकेंट सबमिट दैट पार्टीज आर इन कॉम्प्रोमाइज स्टॉक्स एंड द इशू हैज बीन सेटल्ड हैज बीन द इशू द इशू हैज बीन सेटल्ड एंड द पार्टीज आर एक्टिंग ऑन द settlement some time is required to bring the same on record full stop 3rd of august yes ma'am 3rd of august may i mention sir so to 3rd of may i mention may i request for circulation of one one civil application just on any adjournments for serial uh, number 89 then you go for sir very very serial number 46 <laughs> he said the number oh, first serial number 89 89 I am here for Mr. Ntimhat. Please consent. Request consent. Eighty nine. With by with consent. Consent by consent. So two. Twenty six seven. Yeah, Ntimhat. Serial number forty six. We are requesting for some time. You have you informed the other side? I don't know. I'm mentioning on behalf of Mr. Sudan Sujha. Forty, forty, forty-six. Yes, but you just inform Mr. Shailar actually. He is appearing, Mr. K. V. Shailar. Okay. We'll consider your request. It will be called out otherwise. Called. Ninety-two. Ninety-two. C R A. There is a little village. There are writers tag. C R A. Yes. C R A. There is a. By consent. By consent. By consent. So to twenty six seven interim relief in A O one one eight in C R A two seven two is extended till the next date. May I mention? May I request a circulation of one civil applicant? Civil applicant is bringing is for bringing legal errors on record. The state civil applicant has gone into cut off board. Uh, would your logic notify that civil application? At least that procedure could be completed. Like, I, I think. Just a moment. You can have it on. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah
So you may not touch the merits. No, there's no lordship right below. Issue notice. I'll issue notice. Lordship. <laughs> I made a different argument for him. <laughs> No, is not looking to the order itself, not all 20 documents, most important, not touch at all in the whole order. Now you'll get a fresh. That's who that will be. Uh, I heard Mr. Gandhi, the senior counsel, along with Mr. Hasid Joshi, issue notice. What is the state this thing? Now matter is disposed of possession is not taken. No, we no, no. no. Uh, stay, stay. I am saying other side stay, will have stay to be. Not the, the C. In terms of in terms of seven C. Yes. In terms of seven C. Lost. So we will keep it on second uh, of August. Please. Yes, plus identical fact situation, the very appellant, the very respondent, coordinate bench has issued notice all for the RMP. But despite that, I'll satisfy my Lord's conscience so far as misconceived arguments are concerned. Now, just why do moment, I say just a moment? What is this order? Well, it's identical appellant, the very right. respondent. But the contract is different. Contract is different. What was the amount there? Well, uh, the here amount, it is 93,000. Here 000. it is 93,000 and odd. There the amount was 86,000 and odd. But the point which I would want your Lordship's special attention on uh -huh. is at page 13. Yes. At para 18. Yes. It starts from so far as the arguments. I got that. Including President of India as a party. Now, this, in my respectful submission, is not my argument at all. If Lordship sees Article 299 of the Constitution, okay, okay. and if your Lordship sees Exhibit 50 of the code below, that is my written submission. It's okay, but otherwise, uh, nothing turns on this. This wise, that this is not my argument at all. In as even much, if ignore, even accepting your uh, submission, what difference will it make? Because a contract which is signed by a wrong person or is inadequately processed becomes void. And here in the present case, when my specific contention is that the executive engineer has not signed the acceptance letter, how does it even remotely Who has connect? Signed it, it is not signed. It is a blank. A, Blank acceptance letter given to me. Acceptance of award. My tender. And with, you, you performed it without signature? No, we did not. We told them that, look, gentlemen, this is inadequately stamped and signed. And the requirement of Article 299 is that the contract with the government or by the government has to be adequately. The word, mm. if I may quote from a Supreme Court judgment and a full bench judgment of the Patna High Court, the word is form and manner. The form and manner of the contract have to be as per Article 299. That is the crux of the argument, and that is my argument in the written submissions also. I have not made this submission that the president is not included as party. It cannot be. It is the union through the executive engineer. So my categoric case is that the acceptance letter is not signed by the executive engineer. And that is how the contract is not complete. It is merely an agreement, not enforceable at law. And that is the neat question of law which goes to the root of the matter and that is not decided. But you have accepted the uh, work order. We did. We certainly did. We and you did acted upon it. That is the question on merits this wise that had I been asking only payments on that. What they say is that this is the damages what we have assessed provided in the contract as per clause 2. You pay this much. But for that, the contract itself has to be enforceable. Just for example, as for 84 Supreme Court, my claim for loss of profit that had I been performed this contract, I would have earned this much of profit. But the question would be whether that contract was enforceable or not. I'll issue notice it's a first appeal in any case. But subject to... Uh... 
no, no, that uh, that is why I fairly pointed out this why is that the coordinate bench also said that we'll prime of his issue notice, otherwise it could have directly been admitted. <laughs> That's no, why no, I fairly pointed out. So you out. want it to be? Uh... It can be heard along with this matter. This matter is coming up on the twenty seventh July. Okay. So issue notice returnable on heard Mr. Sukhwani the issue notice returnable on 27-7 to be heard along with first appeal number 1282 of 25. Lordship is it. And if uh, Lordship can just consider para 6, 7, 8 and 9 of the written submissions uh, just for my satisfaction. I will just tell them they are otherwise forming part of the record. If Lordship will call for the RNP, we will otherwise point out at exhibit 50. Let's see on the name. Great, great. Okay, but uh, in the meantime, RNP, uh, RNP, we called for from the this is city civil court, Ahmedabad only. Ahmedabad. Yes. From the city civil court, Ahmedabad. So as to reach before the next date of it. Yes. What do you want to show from written submission? Uh, para six seven. Eight and nine. My specific plea Not that signed. the manner and form of contract has to be as prescribed by the Article 299. Now, this argument or this is not even dealt with or no reflection in the judgment of these arguments. Nowhere in these arguments I have said that the president is not imputed as party. Immensely grateful to my boss. Next. This is leave to appeal. This is you are for the respondent. Yes. Here the uh, plaintiff filed a suit for cancellation of a sale deed below which was executed by the present applicants acting as a power of attorney holder to mm. the defendants. Suit was filed for cancellation of sale deed. It was not filed in the capacity of my power of attorney holder. He filed a suit in the independent capacity, the plaintiff. Mm. Thereafter, my lords, the defendant I was not made a party to the proceeding. The defendant chose not to appear and the suit proceeded ex parte. When the suit proceeded ex parte, my lord, the plaintiff moves an application that now you, by first, uh, amending the prayer in the main suit, that a sale deed may be executed in favor of the plaintiff by the court commission. So what the court does is, court cancels the sale deed, which was executed, and thereafter appoints a court commissioner to execute a sale deed in favor of the original plaintiff. There is an agreement to sell between me and plaintiff and there was a power of attorney between my, uh, the plaintiff and the uh, appellant. But if there was to be a specific performance sought against me, my lords, then I have to be implicated as a party. But by movement amendment in a suit where I am not a party, a relief is sought against me, my lords, and the court grants it. Lords. Relief is sought against you in what sense? That the sale did, which was to be... The, it is to be... See, you were a power of attorney only. No, my lords. Plaintiff was the power of attorney holder of the applicants. My lords will see page 60, lords, uh, 68, it will, of the paper book. I have produced a paper book also, my lords. What do you want to show from paper book? Please do. Yes. Which page? It's page 68. Let's just, my lords will have page 68 minutes. Just a minute.
श्रीमती दीप्ति बेन केवल भाई पटेल This is a for the same property. For the same property, the sale date is executed in favor of the defendant. That is at page seventy-one minutes. Mukundra Amin and Pratibha Ben Mukundra Amin. Hmm. Lots thereafter, my lords will see the impugned suit below. What the page? prayers. What page? Page six below. In the paper book itself. चौबीस This agreement at page seventy seventy one is registered. Please, my lord. It is a registered document. It is a registered sale deed. He is seeking cancellation of that sale deed. Page seven, my lords. My lords will see fifteen one a. Fifty one a. Page seven. Seven. Fifteen one. Fifteen one a. That was my lord the prayer which was amended. आ काम प्रतिवादी नंबर एक थी बे ना दावा वाली बिलकत ना वेचाण दस्तावेज वादी ना नाम नो करी आपे अन्यथा नामदार कोर्ट कमिश्नर नीमी दावा वाली मिलकत नो वेचाण दस्तावेज वादी नी तरफेन मा करी आपे तेओ हुकुम करी ते लगत नो हुकुम नामो वादी नी तरफेन मा करी आपा मेहरबानी करजो तो बिलोट जी एक्स हैज माय पावर ऑफ अटर्नी एग्जीक्यूट्स अ सेल डील्स अमाउंट इज पेड टू मी देयर आफ्टर मिलोट ही गोस एंड फाइल्स अ सिविल सूट फॉर कैंसिलेशन ऑफ सेल डील विदाउट Being my power, he files it in his individual capacity. I can show it from the court title of the civil suit. He files it in individual capacity, seeking cancellation of sale deed. After some time, if the defendant, the defendant chooses not to appear, the purchaser chooses not to appear, so he moves an amendment. Court grants that amendment. Now the decree is passed, whereby court commissioner is appointed and the sale deed is executed in his favor. Hmm. If he is seeking something. Of my property, Lord, I have to be made a party. I have to be heard, my Lord. At least I would be demonstrating that why he is entitled. He has acted in his power of capacity. Admittedly, there was an agreement to sell executed in his favor. Now, the fraudulent mischief which he has played is that the amounts, the check amount, which was shown. You had given that power of attorney to the plaintiff. To the plaintiff. Power of attorney. To my client. To your client. To the plaintiff. There was an agreement. And they now sought uh, uh, execution of the sale deed. Please, my lords. The plaintiff sought execution of sale deed in his name, not in the name of my uh, the appellant, my lords. My lords, I appreciate. A power was given. How the transaction went? I, I, I'll explain. Can I explain? Just explain the transaction. Yes, yes. Therefore, the suit was actually important when the two days when it should have started. So what happened is that when agreement to sale, a possession which is kind of power of attorney executed by them in my favor. In my client's favor, fifty. What what has been executed? Of agreement to sale, mm -hmm. possession receipt, and an uh, and an irrevocable power of attorney. Okay. All these three documents have been executed in my. Okay. By the them. By by the by their clients. They have accepted fifty uh, one lakh rupees and fifty five lakh rupees and all. For whatever. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. Whatever. That amount is accepted by each and every party. Okay. Then after uh, a sale is executed, 
uh, in my uh, husband's maternal uncle's field. Okay. They are family related. Okay. So the suit is that the suit says that that I had executed, executed by them. Uh, by them through me. Power the power of attorney holder in your chose, maternal uncle. Yes, yes. So I, I said that in the suit I said that the sale which was executed in favor of my maternal uncle and power of maternal uncle, wherein the sale deed, the payments are made by me. Everything is made by me. Uh, it is. It should have been done in my favor, but I had done in their favor because of certain reasons which are enumerated. I don't want to go into that right now. So there are certain reasons why it has been executed in his favor. I am saying that he, what he promised me, my, my maternal, my husband's maternal uncle, what he promised me has not come through. Therefore, cancel that sale deed in his favor and, and execute it in my favor. I have already purchased it from there. Their role is over. I have paid them and everything is done. Now they are after. There are litigation entries and everything, which they were aware about since 2008 that this litigation is going between me and my maternal uncle. They are on record, in fact. They are part of the seven trial extracts and everything. They were very well aware, aware about this thing. They did not file any appearance, no application to be joined. They were party. a party. They were not party, you know. I'm not saying that they were party, but they were aware. Because any entry which is made in the seven trial records, they would get 135D notices. At the end of the suit, a decree is passed cancelling the sale deed in favor of my maternal uncle, and the court has executed the sale deed in my favor. The court commission has executed the sale deed in my favor. That is what is under challenge by the present legal appeal. The lords will see page 50 and 74 millions simultaneously. The transaction, the amount of transaction which is referred in the sale deed is the very same transaction referred in the agreement to sale executed in his favor. How can that be possible? Because he is saying that he has paid the money. Money has never been paid. My lords will see page 50. The very check amount, the very date, the very uh, check number, the bank, everything is same. Below. In sale deed, it is said that the purchaser has paid it to the seller. In agreement to sale, it is said that the, uh, uh, the plaintiff has paid to the applicants. For a one particular property, Milos. There is so a now who will be executing the sale deed? The court commissioner has so the court mean, commissioner will do means they, he will take his, their signature. No, no, for the he, court commissioner the maternal will maternal executed in my favor. By the court's order, no. by the but court's order. If I want to get a sale deed executed in my favor, I have to either tell the purchaser that is my maternal uncle to execute in my favor by cancelling his sale deed. Or else I will have to tell the court that after cancelling the sale deed, on behalf of my maternal uncle, you may execute the sale deed in my favor. That is what I have prayed for. That is what there is the privity no, of contract uh, between deed, uh, the there is the privity of contract between him and the purchaser, first of all. I'm just trying if to there's a privity of contract, Milo. If there's a pre any contract. No, but in between them, how does it matter? And the payment setup. If the parties to the suit, please Milo. Are, uh, are at ADM well, and I they are not challenging the uh, this thing. Then please, how are you concerned? I am the if I like to be once you have so, just please, once you have the, sold the property. Please, yes. I have sold it to defendant number two and three. It doesn't matter. I don't want their sale deed to be cancelled. Please, Milord. No, but how are you concerned? Well, I am concerned. Well, well, I am concerned, Milord, because he not paying any amount. Milord had by by playing mischief with the honourable court had got the sale deed executed. But my lord, I appreciate. He is saying that the uh, purchaser will execute the sale deed in his favour, Milord. The purchaser and he has no agreement. Whatever agreement was with me, Milos, for the specific performance, Milos, he could have filed a suit, Milos, against me seeking specific performance. If I chose not, uh, see, so, you received the money, you have sold it. To I have sold it, Milos. Please, Milos. Then now, what, then, Milos, right, a, uh, what right or interest is there in the land? Please, Milos. If the sale deed is cancelled today, then the property has to come back to me. The sale deed is only cancelled with a uh, the, 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 uh, no, direction to reconvey. But then there is no, that is what I am pointing out, Milos, that there is no agreement, Milos, between defendant number one and the plaintiff to say that if the uh, the you sell it after purchasing the property from the uh, may not be, but he has done that. But he has then, accepted the order of the we lost, or he has accepted the then suit. Lord, in what capacity the suit was filed? Below? First, I really appreciate Lord. He was acting. No, no, but uh, see whatever uh, transaction between those two parties. Once you have sold the land, how are Lord, you? Once I have sold the land, Lord, that is what I'm pointing out. Lord, once I have sold the land, he is filing a suit. Though, Whatever that person. But you know, if he's filing that. in the capacity of power of attorney, you know, I cannot say that you know, yes, he's not uh, that I cannot have any say. You know. But he's filing in his individual capacity. I am not being a made any uh, party to the proceeding. You know. The prop he's, he's firstly seeking uh, cancellation of the sale deed. The sale deed has been cancelled by the honorable court. 
there after me lot the status of that property become that the i have been become the owner because a sale transaction has been declared null and void i being the owner me lot now is no no if that sale deed is cancelled then that agreement to sell with possession revives please me lot it revives along with power of it all please me lot it revives then me lot a specific performance decree if has to please me lot i i'll, I'll accept that. that then the specific performance has to be performed me lot then i have to be called upon that you no, now no, no. there was a sale deed He is seeking cancellation of the sale. Sale deed is cancelled, Milord. The police it is, it is cancelled for reconveyance. But that yes. is not the Milord. That is what Milord. It is not simply cancelled and set aside. But my learned friend is not correct in saying that he has not taken the money. No, no, he he has, money. has taken the money. No, no, Milord. I have taken the money from the purchaser, Milord. I have taken the money. That's from what I am saying. Once you have sold it, you are out. Yes. My checks. Have been given to him. There is Twice, all of one. But I, 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 I have a complete. There is only yes. one transaction, my lord, that has been reflected in the check book. Rest of the transaction has not been reflected to us. Let him point out that all the transaction, my lord, that he has mentioned. In no, his... but see, in a just a in a suit filed by him, what relief you can get? My lord, the suit indirectly was for a what post. relief you can lord, get in a suit filed by him? My lord. Minus, my lord, his suit was originally hmm. for cancellation of sale deed. You say you have not received the money. But no. you can't seek any relief. But I know that the suit was originally filed for cancellation of sale deed. There was no ancillary relief to it. You know what position would happen if that suit had been decreed? Then he can file a suit, you know, for specific performance against me, saying that you had executed an agreement no, to sell. Agreement. There is a power of attorney. But that, that, no, it is an agreement to sell coupled with possession. Please, you know, so it amounts so, to sale. Please, you know, so now, you know, so that if I refuse to execute a sale deed in his favor, after cancel, that has already been done. No, no, that has not been done. That is that what was done, that. which has been set aside. No, no, the sale was done with the defendant number two, my lord. Correct. Okay, two only we are talking. But he is the plaintiff, my lord. He is not. So is the plaintiff interse arrangement between the plaintiff and the purchaser is there? But there is no. That is not coming and, out from uh, the record. And how are you concerned then? That is not coming out from the record, my lord. That, that is what I am saying, my lord. That is not coming out from the record. Let me tell you something. Let me just say that since the, because the defendant has not appeared. Hence, the case of the plaintiff is admitted equity. But it is not so much the learned judge. Whatever. Now he, that person is not also challenging that degree. Look, that person is not challenging person, the degree. He may not have appeared. Also, is a different matter. No, he has filed the reply. It has been now reconveyed in his favor. Please me. It has been reconveyed. That man. That, that he may been, not have appeared, but he has that, accepted that the degree. He has accepted the degree. Please me. But Myros may kindly appreciate that the amount which he is to the referring. Every. That now the sale has been produced, but for that part, the amount has to be paid, my lord. The amount which my learned friend is showing that he has paid, my lord, except one amount, except one. See, there are six five checks. A, see, you cannot dispute that. because against that payment, you have already executed a sale deed in favor of his maternal uncle. Now you can't say this was there, that was there, or anything. No, no, but then what you executed a sale deed in favor of the maternal uncle. Please now please. in interse between the parties, if they say that I had paid and now you reconvey this part to me, and the court does that, how are you concerned? I am concerned, my lord, because my lord that you never raise the dispute while executing the sale deed. No, my lord, I am concerned. No, I am, I am concerned. I am, I come into picture, my lord, that if the original suit with the original prayer had it been allowed, my lord. Then he would have to file a suit against me, my lord, making a party to me that I direct them to execute a sale deed. If they fail to execute a sale deed, then that may be done by appointing a court commissioner. That could be the second suit, my lord. He would have filed, or when he moved an amendment, what then, he could or, have done is a different matter. No, now, what he or while moving an amendment, he could have joined me as a party. For what? But, but I am the I'm the the moment you the sale deed, you cease to be an owner. But you know, the, once it is cancelled, my lord. Then the position restored back to me, my lord. That is my submission. The when once he once the sale deed is cancelled, my lord, the position restored back to me. Then merely remains is an agreement to sell between him and me, power of attorney and the possession, my lord. Then it has to be executed on the basis of that, my lord. That for that I have to it be. It is not lord. at your instance that it has been set aside, or it is not at your instance it, that uh, you please, never you have my, never challenged either the agreement to sell along with possession or the sale. Deed. Please, lord. So My, if he is saying reconveyance, he is not saying set aside. Simply re, set aside is not but there. But for it is reconveyed to him. It should be reconveyed to. Him. That is not not for that. By setting not. aside that, it is to be reconveyed to. Him. That is what my suggestion. Now, if there is interest of uh, any financial arrangement between them, how are you concerned? Once you have sold the property. Once I have sold the property, I am not concerned. Please, thereafter, Milord. If 
suit is fine seeking with the first prayer that you cancel the thing right that but is what i'm saying still it will not give you a foothold but we don't for a for, uh, for a moment no? if there was no amendment if there was no order of executing celebrity in his favor what would be the position the celebrity would have been cancelled the tight that that the assumptions would, assumptions no, that no assumption no that is the you know the procedure has assumption to be followed while, no while making an amendment you know he, he ought to have made me a party member he ought to have made me a party member in what he filed his suit in what capacity you know? first of all that has to be examined by the learned judge you know he is not the owner he has not got any right title interest except an agreement to sell now that agree, agreement to sell cease to exist you know my power stands over you know because the sale has been executed so in what capacity he files the suit he does not point out any arrangement that agree between the purchaser and him below he just files a suit basis on this assumption with the first prayer of cancellation of sale below without having any authority to him below i i can understand below that my agreement to sale was in existence and he had filed a suit below so now what will you challenge him no i am challenging that this may be set aside i will be made a party to the suit if that is set aside then the original sale deed revives then please below then then, then what then you know if the court comes to the conclusion that no sale deed is not to be cancelled below then fair enough below but if the sale deed is that, no, yeah. but if the sale deed has to be cancelled below then 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 the position restores back to me below at least i have he remains your power of attorney he will remain below then, but then unless you have a case that it is revoked by you No, and now not, you are you will be executing the not, sale deed fresh sale deed it is the different it is not revocable my lord may kindly appreciate that the sale no, deed nothing nothing you are just trying to gain a foothold no my lord it is not so my lord but that his authority to file a suit my lord has to be determined the learned judge has not examined that aspect he just simply says in the entire order that because the defendant has chosen not to appear therefore i accept the case of the plaintiff as it is But that is not the way that the order has the judgment is. But you are not concerned with the respondent now. He is a purchaser by a valid sale deed. If he doesn't appear, how can you make a grievance? Agreement. I am not saying that he should. But whatever he does, the new purchaser has to assert that can be of no concern. But forget me. He has not appeared. He has not. Please not. But then the lawyer said that. duty incurred upon the learned judge is to examine the case independently you know he has to examine the issue whether the plaintiff has any right title interest in the property or not you know because he cannot seek any right title based on an agreement to sell for which i am not a party admittedly sale deed does not gives him any right there is no oh, agreement between them and the uh, purchaser you know this must this i just third mr uh, Dhruv K Patel and Mr. Mananesha for the parties. By way of the present uh, civil application, the original owner, original owners, uh, pray for leave to appeal to challenge the judgment and order dated 14 to 2020 passed by the. 14th additional senior civil judge vadodara in special civil suit number 315 of 2007 whereby a decree is passed in favor of the respondents here respondents here for reconveyance of the sale deed to stop Mr. Dhruvi K. Patel submits that, being the original landowner, he was a necessary party to the suit, whereby cancellation of the sale deed executed by him was in quest, uh, was prayed for and also granted by the learned trial court, and therefore, in case of reconveyance to the respondents herein, he was a necessary party to the suit and therefore he may be granted leave to appeal to challenge the said order and decree passed by the learned trial court please stop for contrast mr manan kesha manan kesha ish manan kesha learned advocate for the respondent Uh, plaintiff submits that the 
applicants here in were original land owners a transaction was entered into between the parties to the suit and the present applicants here in for purchase of the suit land for which the amounts were paid by the respondents here in and accordingly the applicants had executed the sale deed in favor of the maternal uncle of the uh, respondents here in <coughs> respondent number 1 respondent number 1 here in uh, who was the defendant in the said suit full stop he would further submit that it was an interest arrangement between the parties whereby even though the consideration for the suit land was paid by the uh, by the by the uh, respondents here eh? respondent number 1 here eh? still the sale deed was executed in the name of the defendant her maternal uncle and as the said internal arrangement did not work out a suit was filed for reconveying the sale deed uh, by cancelling the said sale deed and reconveying the same in favor of the uh, respondent number 1 here eh? full stop this court is of the opinion that once this uh, nee nee it is seen from the it is uh, it is seen that the present applicants had executed an agreement of sale coupled with uh, a possession yes. and a power of attorney irrevocable. in favor irrevocable power of attorney in favor of the defendant in the suit as they had sold the land later on they had also executed a sale deed in favor of the said defendant full stop on the defendant number 2 and 3 once the applicants here in had already sold the land for consideration by way of first by way of agreement to sell coupled with possession and an irrevocable power of irrevocable power of attorney and later on by the sale deed comma they had no right title and interest left in the suit property and therefore in the opinion of this court they were not a necessary party to the said suit accordingly the present application is dismissed one more no order is to come sir one more argument the suit would be barred by section 4 of the benami transaction benami transaction please that can be observed because from the okay. reason you write that argument starting rubik patel case mein likh dena he also submits that the suit is hit by the benami transaction act section 4 section 4 of the benami transaction act because what was not given to him was by way of a such suit he is indirectly trying to take that fir abhi isme last mein before we dismiss ke pehle na uske pehle ek para mein likh dena ki matlab jo observation hai isme likh dena that even if accepting the uh, nee right that even accepting that uh, even if it is accepted for the sake of argument that the suit was hit by benami transaction acts to stop still the present applicants will not have any benefit of the they cannot have any benefit or relief from the said fact to stop
full stop yes. now in the year 2021 the uh, the original landowners uh, want to become a party to the transaction seeing that they they money transaction pleading and uh, pleading uh, uh, want to be a party to the transaction on the ground they are a necessary party to the suit yes. <laughs> Time. Time is granted to Mr. Manraj, Learned AGP, for taking appropriate steps in respect of answered expired respondent number one. So to third of August. Mr. Chaya is on leave today. This is for early. Yes, your lordship. This what is, is the, requesting for early date. What is the urgency? Your lordship, the matter has been listed before and has gone out of court several times. So there okay. is some urgency in the matter. Eighth of August. Eighth of August. Much obliged, your lordship. 8th of August to notify on 8th of August. This is also for. Keep it on 10th of August. Sorry? 10th of August. Much obliged, Your Lordship. Thank you. This is also gone in cutoff? Is it also gone in cutoff? Yes, Your Lordship. It has yes. also gone out of board a couple of Very times. Tenth of August. We are appearing. Yes, well, this is also in cutoff. Yes, but, but uh, our reason for the early hearing is that two reasons is that the uh, original respondent means uh, the present applicant. 1.1 says the senior uh, citizen, 84 year old, and, and says basic some medical issues. What is the uh, suit about? A uh, rent suit. Uh, uh, rent the, act. Rent act. You are the original tenant. Tenants. Uh, landlord. 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 We have filed a suit. This has gone in cutoff. That's what yes. you have written. So I'll give a date. I'll give a date. Third of August. I do. Pass it to Yes. yes. Application is preferred to reject the claim on the ground that the original owner has already sold out. The suit was for areas of rent and non-use. Suit is not maintainable. That's yes. G. Yes. And the assignee has not come forward before the court for joining him as a party. Sale deed is on record. Sale deed. Yes, yes, it is on record. G, sir. It is on record. This is your 7 11 application, right? G, sir. Sale what is the what has been held by the trial court? Saying that in the sale deed there is a reference mm. of this pending suit, and where it is referred that uh, yes. after the Possession yes, is taken yes, and the yes. possession is to be handed over. But, but the, the, this is the sale deed, this is the common parlance which are being used. Otherwise, it is not written that it so is a duty. The trial court has held that uh, this is a sale transaction without handing over of possession. Of the particular shop. Otherwise, uh, the uh, partial of one pa parcel of the shop was not, it is rented premises. It was sold with the ongoing suit with all rights. I will kindly see page 17, where it is refer where the trial court has referred the clause which is there in the 
daily. Yes. I am concerned with shop number five, page seventeen, yes, yes. third paragraph. Third, Majkur Bharat. Majkur Bharat, have you seen Tamo Kharidna na Bharat bane chhe? Tamo Kharidna Malik tari ke tevani paise thi so and so Bharat vasul kar agdar bano chhe. Yeti sadra. This is this is the sale deed, right? This is the sale deed, right? But this this pertains to shop number four and one, and now it, the clause pertains to shop number five comes. In the very same trial court order, G. Trial court order. It starts from page thirty-seven B. Thirty-seven A. Thirty-seven A is the is the application. application. Yes. Thirty-seven B is the order. The only one page order. Yes. So now it will have to be proved whether it was handed over or not. The position. Yes, position is not handed over. No, no. Sorry, the. Complete suit was a complete property was handed over along with your possession or not? Yes, sir. Now the our high court has taken the view in three uh, orders. Yes. Okay. Let me see. These are three orders which I think you have given. Yes. It is first appeal two four double zero twelve. First appeal two, two four double zero twelve. Yes. Yes. It is there. Then you have two thousand nine ten SCC. Yes. And then two five uh, Lakshmi Das Morarji, right? Yes. And you have one more of the High Court, which is seventy-four fifteen GLR. And uh, special CF five zero five one two thousand six. Yes, if it is there, Otherwise, special CF five zero five one. Yes. Yes. So the sale is refers that suit is ongoing, and rights are transferred with that. You show the, the relevant portions of the judgment which you are uh, relying upon. Yes. Now uh, the first appeal two four double zero twelve. I may four have, double zero. Yes. yes. May I read paragraph one so that uh, yes the present appeal is directed against the order dated so and so passed by the lower court below application exhibit twenty one whereby the plaint has been rejected under order seven rule eleven a of the civil procedure court. With further direction, the plaintiff to pay cost of rupees two thousand as compensatory, compensatory cost to the defendant for initiating such vexatious proceedings against the defendant under thirty-five C Procedure Court. Now, the short facts are that the appellant original plaintiff filed a suit so and so in the courts of so and so Surat for the relief interior to declare that the defendants have no interest over the suit property, and as per the sale deed dated. 21/11/2006. Read with correction. Read dated 11/4/2007. The plaintiff was the only owner and in possession of the suit property. The second prayer was made by the plaintiff to the effect that the transaction of agreement to sale so and so is null and void. And the third prayer was made the defendants be restrained from creating any obstruction in the land which results into nullifying the ownership and possession of the plaintiff, etc. In the said suit, the defendants appeared and submitted application at Exhibit 21. Contending interior that the plaintiff has already transferred the property by the sale deed number so and so dated five four two thousand seven. Read with the amendment in the sale deed so and so dated eleven four two thousand seven to Natha by Ranchor by Jiwani, a third party to the suit and therefore now paragraph four four onwards four nine and thirteen. Yes. At the outset. It may be recorded that factum of the suit. Four nine and thirteen. Yes. Yes. Factum of suit property already uh, paragraph four already transferred by registered sale deed dated five four two thousand seven. Read with the correction deed dated eleven four two thousand seven. Executed by the plaintiff in favour of Natha by Ranchor by Jiwan third party to the suit proceeding is not disputed by the appellant during the course of hearing. And it was further stated. By the learned counsel, that the force uh, foresight was also admitted before the lower court. Here also, it is admitted the it is recorded in the order that it is transferred. Hence, it can be said that after execution of the sale deed dated so and so, read with correction deed dated eleven four two thousand seven, all rights and interest in the property whatsoever that existed at the relevant point of time were transferred and conveyed by mm -hmm. the plaintiff in favour of Natha by Ranchor by Jiwan. So, In five two thousand eleven, therefore, on the date when the suit is filed, the rights in the property was already conveyed and transferred in favour of Natha by Ranchor by Jiwani long back by the plaintiff, approximately prior to four years. As for the provisions of transfer of properties, act once the registered sale deed is executed, all rights in the property whatsoever existed 
of the vendor stand transfer to okay. the okay issue notice heard mr tushar is learned advocate of the ac issue notice data ne belong this is at gundal right ji sir data ne belong 10th of august ad interim release in terms of prayer clause it c it c in the meantime till the next date of hearing रीजनिंग टोटली फ्लॉड मेरो एंड योर योर ऑक्सी जस्ट द बेसिक फैक्ट्स आई विल गिव यू हां प्लीज गिव द बेसिक आई आई गिव द बेसिक फैक्ट्स नो बट योर ऑक्सी मेजर स्लो रणछोड़ जी भाना भाई देयर आर थ्री प्रॉपर्टीज दे ऑल बिलोंग टू रणछोड़ जी भाना भाई एंड ही एक्सपायर्ड ऑन 24 2050 दिस इज इंपॉर्टेंट नो आई आई विल गो टू द प्लेन आई हैव नेक्स्ट द प्लेन दे आर ऑल देयर बट आई हैव जस्ट टेकन आई एम स्टेटिंग द फैक्ट्स फ्रॉम जस्ट जस्ट गिव मी योर मिनट यस यस See here. Yes, sir. Here you are only on the ground of limitation. No. More importantly, no cause of action. <coughs> Not both the grounds because, I have taken. Because A and B both will not have taken, <coughs> and the reason is, you know, why no cause of action? And apparently there cannot be any other answer for the reason that, you know, this person Ranchod Bai he had one son Prema Bai and one daughter uh, Ganga Bai. Not Ranchod Bai died in fifty before in Hindu Succession Act came into force in fifty six. Had he died after fifty six, there would have been a cause of action because their daughters could get the share. But before fifty six, under own Hindu law, it is an established position, and the judgment is also cited. I have given it to them. The court doesn't consider daughters had no share. So if daughters had no share in fifty, I mean, these plaintiffs in fifty nineteen fifty five zero. So fifty cause of action a suit is filed in two thousand fourteen. Apart from time bar, so you know that is clause D, barred by any provision. But you know order seven to eleven A, no cause of action at all under law. You know, daughter if daughter cannot inherit, what take everything to be correct in the plane. Everything what they are saying is correct. No transaction is of when? No, not the transaction, the inheritance aspect. You know, nineteen fifty. Your suit is for what? Not my suit. I am. I am a different. You are sorry, different. The, the suit, suit is, is for party. They say that we have a share. Ganga Ben had one half. You share. are the brother of the. Yes. What I, is I, the interest relation? Yes. Just give yes, me some I, facts. I, I, I'll tell you lots. So not your lots. You may just see. Ranchod Bai was the original one. Okay. He died in 1950 before Hindu succession. Okay. Now he had one son and one one daughter. That is important. One son is Prema Bai, and the daughter was Ganga Ben. The plaintiffs are you not know, the heirs, not even the sons of um, or daughters of Ganga Ben. They are probably the grandsons of Ganga um, you know, no, no. Ben. They file a suit against you know, the original brothers Prema Bai's uh, son. So I am for the legal as, legal. legal as of Prema Bai who had inherited the property in fifty. You know, Not these grandsons of Ganga Ben. Ganga Ben has also expired in ninety three. So they are claiming through her. They don't do anything from nineteen fifty. they don't do anything 2014 a suit is filed saying that we ganga ben should have had a share which is again in law which she could not have belonged in 50 and therefore we are entitled partition our share and give one for one third, one third, one fifth one half share this is their suit you know. now everything take it to be correct she, all relation the, the suit land is still being held by you yes we not one of the property is sold off But out of three survey numbers, if your ownership is one is sold off. That is sold off in two thousand five itself. So that will be excluded. So that would be excluded. They have challenged the sales deeds, but that is also time barred. Not even about two thousand five registered sales deeds. We not section three deem notice. They have to file it within three years. So two thousand eight, they come in two thousand. We not this is nothing but not an amnesty. You do something, you get get more money. Otherwise, we not and there are judgments. We not your ownership will see uh, the, this high court judgment. I will just read. Is that notice prior to the enactment of Hindu Succession Act? Yes, sir. And what the further proceedings of the suit may be said. So there is no plot on. Uh, is your notice? 
the third Mr. S. P. Carpentier, learned advocate for the applicant. Issue notice. Fourteen B belongs. Attempt and relief in terms of prayer clause fourteen B. Yes, correct. Fourteen B. Till the next date of hearing. All right. If we have. Twenty second August. Okay. But the limitation would be an alternative plea. We don't need to go to that also. Right. No, actually, in Fulwati, uh, in Fulwati versus that uh, the judgment from yes. the Supreme Court. Later on, Justice Sikri has taken a view that it is retrospective. It is. It is not just. No, that the is the two thousand. No, that is that two thousand five amendment. Amendment, but that amendment even is retrospective. Uh, huh, yes, yes, that is right. But that is that is not for co partial. The daughters being the co-partners, that 2000, I think five or eight amendment that is held rabbit retrospective. Yes, right? retrospective. That has been held. That because, is held retrospective. Because, uh, because uh, first the bench held that from the date of amendment they have. Yes, yes, that is now held to be retrospective, but that is for the purposes of her being a co-partner, not for the purposes of Lord Hindu succession at which came in 56. And not daughters not having a right therein, so that's a different thing altogether. This is not even a co-partner property. So that aspect is not here involved at all. That that is your lot. Sir, right? Two thousand five amendment held to be retrospective unless it is partition. Unless it is partition. Partition. Yes, and so on. So that otherwise they would have. Yes, yes, that's right. Otherwise, you know, even prior. Yes. That also they get. Unless partition. Yes, that is right. I I appreciate, but that will not apply here. We are here in nineteen fifty six. You know, we are expanding fifty. They don't do it for sixty five years. They, apparently, it is a malapartition. I'm deeply upset. Deeply upset. Date क्या दिया? Twenty second of August. Twenty second of August. Okay. Serial number fifty two thirty Pandya. Who is that? Sick note. Entry of the sick note filed by Kunjal Pandya. SOP. Twenty seven. Twenty nine seven. Serial number sixty two. Let me get the date. Let me. I was appearing for the contesting response. For some accommodation, <laughs> if it is not inconvenient, or the uh, only request, my learned friend, is that the matter before the trial court on on Tuesday, he may not insist for, or your lordship may keep the matter on Monday also. Yes. I have no difficulty. No difficulty. It will be kept on Monday. We will be ready by the time. Or any day, and uh, you have to agree that you will. Uh, Not object, or or the honourable court can provide that parties will be at liberty to ask for date. We'll keep it on nineteen seven. Nineteen seven. And parties will be at liberty to. Uh, Learned uh, counsel, Mr. Zubin Barda, appearing on behalf of the respondent, seeks some accommodation. Prayer granted. Uh, SO two nineteen seven. In the meanwhile, parties are at liberty. Pilots were not seen. Parties are at liberty to uh, make a joint request to the learned trial court on the next date of hearing for an adjournment. And in view of this pendency, the trial court is expected uh, to uh, by consent with Lakshmi. No, but uh, suppose they don't give, bro. That's it. Uh, which may After be considered favorably by the trial court in view of the uh, next date of hearing. Please oblige. Oblige. I can be permitted to tender one of the paper book to my learned friend also, so that he may. Uh, Mr. K. V. Shailar. Mr. K. V. Shailar attend has tendered the paper book in the matter, which is taken on record. I am obliged to the court. Please. That three meter notes. Two one zero may be. Yeah, two one zero may be taken up because they have produced this whole an excerpt in there. Two one zero. The last one, the Martino, they do for last one. The suit was filed by the two persons. Page fourteen is the plate. Yes. Here is the seven eleven on the ground of limitation as well as no cause of action. 
suit was for the partition. 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 Page fourteen by the uh, widow right. as well as by the one uh, daughter. Now let's see. Kindly see the uh, reading plain as it is. Page sixteen is the P degree. Yes. The Bhagwant Lal has Damodar died on 2016. The plaintiffs here are the uh, Meena Bel and Kamu Bel, daughter and the plaintiffs. wife. Yes, Meena Bel and Kamu Bel. The rest of the old. Uh, I'm sorry. And the rest of all the defendants are the legalists have been joined as a defendant. Now, Lord Sir, may kindly see reading plain as it is. They have specifically admitted that lands were defendants. Yes, even their uh, children. Yes, no, 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 children are not there. The, there are uh, only sir, these sister, brother, sisters. Brother, sister, they are the defendants. Now, reading the plain as it is, there was a, a partition was there. The kitchens were also separated. And there is also reference is made in respect of posing the respective uh, plaintiffs' uh, names in the seven rectal access. No, no, no. What is the prayer? Now let's yes, the yes. prayer in the suit, yes. Page 25. Lavari Jamino Yane, Surat District, Chores Soyan Salma, said Surat New Daril, Adistar Masama, Stemma, the Dajan Taluka, Tarika, or Kata Moja, Utran, Niche, Seven Number Vari Jamino, all the list of the properties have been stated. And page 26, Vadi Jamino Ma, Rail Amo Vadi Tarika, the Rekno, once a Chacham, Ponotel, Isa, Lake Kul Becha, Ponotel is so agar to Kaida Proman Amo Adino, Lago Porto, Ponotel is such Aduti Sutta Vadi. Isano protects the Globo Adino of Pausoji, so and so the Vadi, what is Jamino Akamna Vadita Potesa Hindu, Ekati Kutumi Malikini Kabja, Eternal Chalival Horu, the Tema Jamino Vadino, Vonazal is so Chalival Horu, the Avadi Jamino Sadabia, Potios and Ekla, Arku Prokare, which I'm working with Stako and Apo, Pia Novanu, Jared Mugunam Lama so and so it's been made. A lot she may kindly see, ever men in respect of all properties what they have stated. Page sixteen, first time is eaters. One six. Yes, uh, the seven to eight line from body. From to TV, no crini avak per same rakam outi, Samajata temas kutumna sabio ma vadarotata, so the damodas lalbaina same kutum alakra varel, Param to eight from a terbat, Bagutla damoda kunria, ane, tena varadar nundu ekatukum taliavel, tema teun ekatrapam ketikam taliavel, Bagutla damoda kirina tamam varadar reon to the record, regu, taliavel sadru, Bagutla kirina varadar peki, amovadi. The Padia number eight and a B, she is a very tuna lagna tata, lagna hako puga putana patina gre, the Taya Sarvat Mateo Hindu, uh, Ekata Kutumna, uh, Karta Vodil, uh, Purus and a manager Tarikamara Vodil, Paganda Son of Talia, Timatimna, Son, but Kutumna Katari, the Nagbe down the Alital, a mam Hindu, and so in Talia. Now let's see, Page eighteen. What do you want to show from this? Yes, pay, 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 Dawari so and so, Jamulam Gordillo, Damuda, Lalba, Kane, Potana, Ekatra Kutuna, Nanamati, Sagala, Lamju, Karikra Mavel, and Sadru, Thunderbe, known notari, Tisa, Bija, Setalis, Narotema, Damnamunomo, Sadbarma, Perpan, known, Tansopata, Dakal, Terba, Sadru, Damuda, Lalba, Potana, Vajri Karati, Potana Dikra, Bogatla, Damuda, Patni, Kurben, Tanu Nam, Puk, Sagurta Katar, Perpan, known number, Matari, Pandar, Agar Bija, Pasan, or Dakal, Kril, Ted, Promana, Bogurta, Damuda, Sepon, Potana, Samaik Prana, Lake Nadare. Part Char Bija Satnaro Tepan non number so and so team Potara Varasar of Peki, Padi number eight Minaben, the Pratino Tantan Nam Nam Nakiatem, Bagotla Dabunan of Santa, the Tepan number so and so the Titarik, the Sagar, the Dust Bija Sonaro, Bagotla, the Tamam, Padro Nam, the Minma, Gamnuna, Saduma, Adun, Chali Avelse. The Minaben's name was already given, her share was given. Minaben is one of the plenty that reference is coming. Again, Lord Simakalesi B. 
दाखिल कर भगवतलाल दामोदर आधार तारीख पांच चार सात नोट फेर लोडशीपीटिंग Lord Mr. Shakil Gureshi, Learned Counsel for the applicants, he submits that the the plaintiffs have already been uh, given their share yes. in the property and therefore they have no right in the joint property. Revenue records, their names also. Uh, even the revenue records depict the same. Please. Okay. Issue notice. Returnable on 18th August. Please. <clears throat> Add interim relief in terms C. of prayer clause. Eight C loss. Uh-huh. Eight C. Eight C. Please. Probably in the, the next date of year. Yeah. In all matter, eight C loss. All three. Days. In all the matters, it eight is C. same. Eight C. Same. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Three. No, my common order. Kar dena. We'll tag it. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes. Yes. <coughs> three. No, my common order. Kar dena. Eighteen, uh-huh. eight. In the earlier letter, your lordship has said that the trial court will consider favorably. Reasonably, your lordship will say that again. Favorably. Said, you know, the difficulty is for that I have it's keeping in view. Keeping in view the next date of hearing. But they don't. Uh, I mean, take the words for it. The trial court shall adjourn the matter. That's it. When they are asking for the time. Let it so, be. So, lordship, no. Man, I hope that. Bad experience for. We will uh, we will see if he doesn't do it. We will see. Let him interpret. Oh. <laughs> no, then then. Let the trial court interpret it. We will see. Because they say that no, there is pressure from the uh, honourable court, and which we must proceed. There is the an matter. order. If he wants to interpret in another way, you let me know on the next date. Okay. We will see. Not sure. Deeply open. You know what? Please put the word in your. उंसिलेक्टेड Yeah, with respect to uh, unserved respondent number three, unserved expired respondent number three, SO two, twenty sixth July. RNP be also called for since the first. Twenty sixth RNP is not received. It was called for but not received. That's right. That's right. the endorsement. Please, it will please. Please. Twenty sixth seven. Please, please. During the pendency of the reference, the one of the applicant has expired. So you have to. So I have made an application before this one, but this one of the court has delegated. I have moved an application before the trial court that has been allowed. Therefore, the civil application has been. So all the three applications are to be allowed. Please. You write that got the counsel for the parties. Uh, Yeah, number one, two, and three. 
actually CA number two पहले आएगा इस अलाउ फिर CA number in view of the uh, in view of the uh, uh, in view of disposal of CA number two CA number one is allowed amendment to be carried out in the cost title of the first appeal and third my you write that uh, delay is condoned rule is already served so delay is condoned yes, she waves a uh, you wave a uh, rule whatever you just give your yeah, appearance yeah, you give appearances and uh, in uh, one uh, yeah, three, 23 mein likhna that uh, delays phone don't uh, uh, issue rule that she waves rule on behalf of uh, uh, a learner dgp waves rule on behalf of respondent and uh, admit this is not admitted yet no lord so but admit, other cognate matter has been admitted and fine admitted uh, admit lik dena first appeal mein admit to be heard along with number de do yes sir right oh just you give the number in lunch yes i will give the number complete you know this code hey you know ni matlab third wala to wo first appeal admit karke wo ye de bas tag along with kar do okay yes 24 चौबीस से बत्तीस में थर्टी टू ट्वेंटी फोर टू थर्टी टू यू राइट दैट फर्स्ट अपील में एडमिट कर दो इट इज नॉट एडमिटेड इट नॉट इट एडमिट टू बी हर्ड अलोंग विद एनी ग्रुप इज देयर no no this is the entire group uh, this civil application may be called for as and when it's kept place for filing नहीं हाँ and uh, इसमें एक uh, this is uh, Which is that application? It is. Well, it's, it's one of two thousand twenty-two in the first matter seven four zero. Is my additional me likh dena jo uh, in se uh, wo F A jo ye chob chobis number ka jo matter hai usme likh dena ki C A number one of twenty twenty-two for uh, additional evidence to be heard along with the first appeal uh, number seven four zero twenty. I'm obliged. <laughs> सेपरेट कर देना सब में एडमिट कर देना एडमिट कर एडमिट एक्सेप्ट एंड दे एक्सेप्ट नोटिस दे एक्सेप्ट दे वेव नोटिस एजीपी का जो अपीरेंस है ना केस में सो एंड सो वेव सर्विस जस्ट अ मोमेंट दिस इज वॉट दिस वॉज थ्रू थर्टी फाइव दिस इज थर्टी फाइव ऑन दिस नॉट शोस दिस इज फॉर ब्रिंगिंग इयर्स आई थिंक येस लॉट शो एंड देर आर टू सिविल एप्लीकेशन फॉर स्टे This is C A number one for stay. This is C A number one for stay. In fact. One for stay, not sure. And there are two separate civil applications filed for bringing for, legal for hire legal in, in first appeal as well as C. Right, but for before that, before stay, we'll have to bring the legal legal hire, not sure. Yes. Why both the C A's are same? One CA is filed in CA for stay. Another CA is filed in main first appeal for bringing legal. Since civil application for stay was pending. Thirty six and thirty seven में लिख देना. CA for bringing legal as on record of respondent number one is allowed. 
cost right will be amended accordingly within a period of two weeks. Then 39 and 40. CA, uh, CAs are disposed of. Then 39 and 40 is another. Just a minute. Uh, or ye 35 mein likna, CA for stay mein issue notice to the. Roshib, notice is already issued and other side is already appearing, but that may be uh, uh, kept after two weeks so that other side may come in. Okay. 35 mein likh dena, SO2. Second of August. No, no, no. Play simply SO2. Simply after this. Uh, 35 is simply SO2 to 8. 36 and 37 are allowed. 38 is also another. 38 and 39 now. No, 38 only. 38 is expired. 30, 38 is uh, for stay. No, no, he has expired. He is, he is unsaved expired. That's why we have brought the uh, serial number 39 and 40. That's 39 a, is for same uh, person. No, for another person. No, no, but uh, uh, similarly. Yes. 36, 76. Same group. 39, right? actually, the name is not shown. 39. But it is the same Juma Achar Koli. Lord Chip, same. Anyway, uh, you write similar order. Similar order we will give. Lord Chip, 39 and 40. 38 may SO2 28 uh, 2228 Kanto, 2nd of August. 38. 39 and 40 allowed. Amendment to be carried out. Much of Within two weeks. Yes. This is the Lordship. I am for the appellant Lordship. See, if I am the original defendant and I'm facing the decree of the learned trial judge, and therefore this is the first appeal by the unsuccessful defendant. Unsuccessful? Defendant. Defendant uh, means uh, uh, your tenant. Lord Chief Jesus. Essentially, the, because during the pendency of the appeal, Lord Chief, the order has been passed to deposit the means profit. That's the order passed by the learned trial Main judge. Profit. Which the uh, the present appellant has challenged that order before this honorable court. This honorable court has also accommodated the present appellant, gave some time to deposit the money as the order passed, but he has not deposited. With the result, under order 8210, the defense of the defendant has been stuck off on the application moved by the original plea. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Since the present appellant has not complied with the order. The uh, original plaintiff moved the application under order 8210 for striking of the defense of the present appellant. And the learned trial judge has passed the order rightly. And the defense of the present appellant has been stuck out. Stuck off. Now, only the issue which now that I just took in my present memo of appeal. It's all right. The, uh, because non compliance of the order, the obviously order 810 will definitely apply. But the but to participate in the proceeding in the sense to cross-examine with, uh, with the original plaintiff, that right has not been taken away. Because my defense has stuck off. Right to defend, to right to participate in the proceeding, meaning thereby to cross-examine the plaintiff, that right has not taken away under order 8 rule 10. Number one. Number two, my vaklatama was there. So your contention is that it is not an ex parte procedure. Absolutely. It's unlike the, the party has not filed the WS or mm -hmm. the party has not filed the vaklatama. That situation is not here. Here I filed the vaklatama. I have filed my return statement also. Now that return statement doesn't require to good. consider by the court in view of that order passed below order 8 rule 10. No difficulty on that. But nonetheless, I have every right to cross-examine the witness. And I'm so entitled to receive you move, the, Did you move an application? No, but there I not moved before the learned trial, just straight away. And the honor kindly just see the order 1804. Simply has filed the affidavit. That, that affidavit by tendering before the court, the plaintiff has not entered the witness box. He has to confirm and he has to give the oath before the court. But did you move an application that you want to cross examine the plaintiff? No, but he has not entered the witness box, Lordship. Lordship, just see the 184. I have filed the compilation. You may not have entered, but 
if you, if you want no, to go, first he has to enter the witness box he has to reaffirm what he has to say then my chance my my turn to cross examine the witness and in addition to that the whatever the documents is yes standard i am entitled to receive receipt of that also nothing has been served upon me yes file in the court the court has accepted and the decree on the ground that the, the amount has not been paid that essentially that is only the one ground for which the decree has followed against me so in my did you file any written argument no i have not filed you are not oral also and therefore in the present civil application and also in the memo of appeal i have made the statement on oath that i am ready and willing to deposit the entire areas which has been ordered by the learned transcript subject to the order of this honorable court But it says oral evidence has been is there. No, but Lordship, just kindly, I have filed the compilation. Lordship, kindly oblige me by turning the evidence or the written rule for affidavit which has been tendered by the plaintiff. Lordship, just give me a minute. I'll give the page number of my compilation. So it was a leave and license agreement. Lordship, please. And according to me, it says only for a one month. Yes. And now I have produced the evidence before the court. and in fact the before the present suit filed by the uh, the original plaintiff i already filed the suit in 2007 for for uh, seeking the injunction against them what happened to that that suit is still pending injunction has a for from not to take the possible possession of the premises now his case is lot chief just kindly see the plain in compilation page number 1 lot chief paragraph number 4 page number 2 hmm. am i with the court sadru milkat namo vadiya pratiwadi ne tarikh 1 8 2009 na roj reva mate api tyare bhadam ne mas ma now according to me the legal license executed on 1st august 2009 now in 2009 i already filed the suit and i produced the documents of 2007 in my suit what you just kindly see they are appearing in that suit yes or she just kindly turn page 111 of the compilation present appellant who is the plaintiff in the suit hmm. at page 311 hmm. 2639 2009 so but that will become in court just now it's all right i am only on i am just because placing the arguments before the court that, uh, becomes in court no, no, your no, prayers no. become in court no difficulty on that but the issue is that if according to the case of the original plaintiff leave and license executed in august 2009 how come i am in the property prior to that his case is only on the leave and license executed on in august it is only for one month and his case is that possession has been given in august 2009 now how come the documents are in in the custody of the plaintiff which i am in the present appellant which shows the period prior to august 2009 for that matter lordship just kindly turn uh, just on so mr dr shall an advocate appearing on behalf of the appellant submits that it is the case of the plaintiff that the suit property suit premises was given to him on lease on 18 2009 whereas I am sorry, Mr. Yes. Mehta is appearing on KVL. He has replaced the earlier advocate. Is his name? We will have to pass it over. Can you call? Yeah, because therefore this. Okay, pass over. 
Yes. This is under the ESI Act. Contribution has been yes. reduced. And it is not reduced as well as not paid in time. So interest which we have charged upon them, which is not accepted by the team. Which is? By the court. Under Regulation 31A. Yes, I But two, two, two things there. Which are the two things? One is reduction. One is reduction and from, one is that particular amount from paid 30, 35 under from, section 2, 722, hmm. which is this to be paid and upon wages, they have to pay the contributions, which they have not paid. We have called upon for paying of the interest, not damages. Interest under section under regulation 31A and section 222 with regard to wages. What are the amount paid by your charges hmm. to the they are liable to pay the contribution, ESI contribution. But it has been that contribution they it has, they have been directed, but only uh not Inter so interest. but In it is not. It's the notice for interest which is issued. Which is cancelled by the trial court. Oh no, just see page six. Page six two. Samavaraya Atla Rupya Vaj Mirava Kadel notice Rat Karvama. Okay. So notice issued under regulation 31A is cancelled by the trial court. Because they have not paid the third read the third one. That that is different, sir. Bevarasni Vyadni Ganati Kari Vya Sam Samavarana Atla and the Bari Parik Apanayas. So my total claim with regard to interest is 35,000. Now, according to this, how much will it be? 17,000 they have to pay. And this 18,000 I'm also claiming by a, the notice issued by the corporation. So it comes to 35 only? 35 total. And you, had, and you had asked uh, in the notice, you had asked for what? This interest only. For the same yes, amount? Yes, same, same. So then what, what is the challenge now? This year. The court has not considered my contention. Court has rejected that eighteen thousand. No, so thirty total amount is thirty-five thousand. Out of eighteen thousand, court has considered that they are you are not entitled. So seventeen thousand upon seventeen. What does three say? Please read. A kamna aradha rupee ada jar saat chhod gaya baad taka leke be varasni vyadni karna sri kari sama vada na three divas under barwa nahi reshe. But then, then total out of 35, 18 remains, 18 they have to pay. 35 was with interest? With interest. Total total interest. Interest upon the non-payment of the contribution. Okay. So now, now, uh, now upon the 17. What is the direction now? According to this order. So my notice for 35,000. Now, now they have to pay 12% interest for two years on 18,000. On 18. For 17,000, they are not, not, no direction is given by the so my total notice is for 35,000. That was for interest or with interest? Total interest. Total interest for uh, non-payment of contribution in time. 35,000 was your interest? Was interest. Vyaj Mero. Vyaj Mero. That, is, that was my interest. So, away, away, uh, away, that, was, that was on what amount? That contribution. Which uh, total amount? Total, total contribution. What was that amount? In that total exactly contribution was how much? Million. How much? That is not stated in the judgment. So just show your notice, show cause notice, it will state it. See your show cause notice. Or you'll have to produce all those papers. Well, I don't have the papers for that particular notice. Ah. Can it be called uh, RMP may be called for? No, you file it. I file this is a fresh case. Fresh, fresh case. Just ah, so you file it. Okay. Uh, Mr. H. S. please for some time to place on record relevant documents. Time as played for is granted. 26th of July. Much. And next matter.
Next matter is employment injury. The injury to the employee is out of the premises. Hmm? Not the read. Page five. Page five. Yes. Um, para twelve. Aradha no yoke kese ke tevo na pati tarik atna roj parat parthi chutti ghare cycle upar ring road upar police chokki thai Rameshwar mobile na me dukan paase the rati aat lagya na sumar kasar thata aata kya so this is not during the employment this is out of out of the employment so in view of that there are two judgment of this court as well as the owner of a supreme court will obtain basis. Supreme Court, 432. No, no one, single. What are uh, I cited two judgments in my appeal memo also. <coughs> 1997, Supreme Court paid 432. No small extension. And 2001, one GLR paid 284. That is also followed by the Supreme Court. They believe the accident is occurred out of the premises of the, then their employer is not entitled for this. Benefit under the ESI Act. But except the order, nothing is placed on record. Hmm? Something has to be placed on record. We don't have, we are not getting any document from the government also. This is the central government. That's it. No, no, you can ask for that. A just complete case paper should be forwarded to you. It is it was in the POV also. Mr. H. S. Shah submits that the death has occurred outside the injury. Injuring thereafter. Sorry, the injury and the the injury as sustained by the deceased is yes. was uh, cannot be said to be an injury which was employment in, in the course of his employment. And therefore the employee was not entitled to any benefits under the ESI Act. Issue notice returnable on 22nd August. Earlier, two to three times, the director to my learned friend, who has appeared. Mm -hmm. Here, the matter the matter is covered matters. Therefore, mm -hmm. out of there are seven matters, Lord. Out of that, in five matters, in low it has been disposed of. Lord. This one is uh, remaining. How much is the amount here? Yeah, here is Lord, five lakh forty two thousand. There were four forty two thousand. Therefore, the courts asked that whether it and also on marriage. Five lakh, up to five lakhs, there is a circular. Up to five lakhs, yes. Now, of course, the 42,000 letter may be disposed of, but even no, I'll do one thing. I'll do one thing. 26. 26 Lok Adala, finish it off. Only for 42,000, that order can be passed. Please. Huh? Otherwise, we, married also, Milad. Right, right. right. Uh, otherwise, there's yes. nothing remaining yes. there for 42,000. Yes, yes. yes. And that is, Milad, in 2016. Now, Milad, in uh, 22, Milad. To, to be placed uh, in Lok Adala, to be held on 26th of June. Please. I mean, this five lakh similar in 2017. Now, to 22, the 10 lakhs must be there. No, no, but that they have to come with a notification. Yes, sir. 26, 6, 26, 6. 26th of June, Loka Dalar. To be placed in Loka Dalar. Serial number 45, one trigger, which Archida you have made. This is the same group, but the hospital deposited the amount. And the. 
This is the same group. Yes, same group. Cost of it, one cost of it, four zero six zero twenty one. So we will just uh, tag with. Yes, That's all. Only tag with it. Will be only tag with. Yes. That that appeal is admitted. This cost of it. This cost of it. Admitted tag with that cost of it. Admitted uh, uh, admit tag with numbers who appear. Cost of it. Four zero six seven of twenty one. Four zero six seven. Yes, for 21st appeal number. And so far, civil application was for stay. Yes, that is amount is issue rule. Amount is different. That is already done. Yes, that is already done. Uh -huh. uh, it is submitted by a learned at AGP, Ms. Asmeda Patel, that uh, in the uh, connected matter, yes, uh, wherein the respondent number two has filed the first appeal. The yes. amount has been deposited and directed to be withdrawn also. Fifty percent amount is directed to be withdrawn also. Therefore, no orders on the application for yes. so CA number one, then no orders will add. Dispose we can dispose it of. Uh, hey, CA number one is disposed of. Only 50 percent is deposited. No, 100 percent must have been withdrawn. So, no orders in your case. In that matter, it is not the same matter, same group. Hey, for then uh, it has been deposited. Nah, deposited. Entire amount is deposited. Against the same claimant, uh, uh, Archana Amin not, has not also filed. Against this same claimant. Okay. Claimant is filed. It is, uh, those liquid, it is submitted by Learned EGP uh, that uh, the uh, amount awarded uh, by the reference court uh, along with interest and solution has been deposited in the trial court. Full stop. Therefore, uh, uh, issue rule uh, returnable uh, on 2nd of August. Let them come, we will then pass it. Uh, he was here, Mr. Shailok was here. Millards, uh, the other side, Mr. Aja has informed that he is not well, Millards. Therefore, Mr. I am Aja. Yes, Millards. I am on behalf of Mr. K.V. Shailok, Millards. Aja, you are on behalf of Yes, Millards. they had mentioned in the morning, somebody. Okay. Uh, so I will just take them to Millards. Uh, SO2. One eight. At the request of Mr. Sudhanshu H. S.O. 21. In view of the sick note filed by Mr. Tunjale Pandya, S.O. 38. Number 48, Mr. Gaurav Devanta, Mr. Bharat. Any settlement? No, there is no. Last so, time uh, it was observed. That was observed. That was the order passed by my Lord uh, oh, Justice Kita Gupti. Uh, the dismissal of the employee. No, no. If you see the last order. Yes. If you see the last order, uh, this Lord, we had put to the bank. There is no positive instruction. This is with, uh, to the, huh? Huh? in regard to the settlement, as suggested. Right. No, it was the court. Huh? Since the since the lady has retired, has is uh, reached at the age of superannuation after putting up thirty four years of service. This huh? is the sole incident, huh? and uh, this incident is only for negligence. There is no uh, involvement, direct involvement. So far as criminal case is concerned. All of them are mm -hmm. honorably acquitted by the um, competent court. Therefore, the uh, earlier bench put it to the uh, my learned friend's colleague that 
if anything can be find out then uh, now she is retired she is uh, uh, she attained the age of superannuation she has put in 34 years of service what was the suit for what was the suit for the suit for uh, that is against the dismissal my lord so after acquittal they are not reinstated no lord sir so you are you are seeking reinstatement with benefits or any or benefit retirement benefit because i am retired now i have put in 34 years of service my lord she was working in ahmedabad yes this is in bank in bombay no, mercantile cooperative in ahmedabad ahmedabad both the parties are from ahmedabad yes sir go to lok adalat if something can be done 26 to be is correct not to i mean in not to but let it let their officer come before the lok adalat and say something yes because this court was it was from the court the proposal was from the court that's why so when we refer it to lok adalat on 26 since the parties are from ahmedabad yes try if it can be please but because of the divisions the fraud was committed with the bank that is a but they are acquitted also negligence is there but that was a different case they got to see this Arising out of some of the negligence because of which some of the fraud was committed. Right. Now that she has retired, if something I can be given, lump sum it can be. I mean, I have taken it. I have taken it. Okay. Very well. So referred to local dollar. Twenty-six six. Okay. Please do this. Number fourteen. I am Mr. Harish Chitrivi. so there is no question of an, now arguing the delay now only the question is whether what i am entitled to and what compensation has been offered to me delay is already condoned therefore appeal is pakka number delay of may address it also sir is a delay condone kare na office keeper kare na adhi se dress mein delay hai ye condone kare therefore this pakka number is the, now therefore on merit submission is that uh, the <laughs> application was delayed by yes the one before the application, application was delayed by 12 well years now. So that is totally misconceived kindly but now there is no question of are submitting anything on uh, delay because okay, delay is condoned and appeal is admitted right uh, that we will now decide please my lord but uh, i was saying if your people are inclined to give at least something then but work it out finding that is his calculation exorbitant i'll point out lord really that's what I'm, it may be exorbitant but do you have a counter offer But I am asking that. But I put it to them. If there is a counter offer, I put it to them. They are uh, they are at uh, Baroda. Yes. 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 I can. I will be able to call them. Any day. Okay. Go to local and try to find. I am agree. But ask, any, any ask, ask an to officer to be there. But I would rather request. Let it be before my lord. No, no. Here, I have to. No, I. No, I. it will they will again refer it to this court don't worry but at least try look at that bring an officer something can be given to him it give it the last time last time you lot you are a from the company, company it was suggested yes there are government companies yes uh, company as suppose uh, there are certain thing but on merit side point out not today so model employer thing will apply to you <laughs> there is a finding vadodara ki chennai any entire treatment during All fourteen years of service, I have done. But what about what compensation? I am not saying no treatment. What about compensation? Complete. Let him complete. <laughs> And loss, not a loss of revenue to the present applicant in my service to a single penny. In fact, there are increments. There is finding on that account. And after twelve years, when he retires, then he files a complaint on the ground that since my treatment was going on, loss, I did not have that disability certificate, and therefore I have not filed. Identical facts, circumstances, loss. There are judgments from. This honourable court from the honourable Bombay. He is retired now. Yes, but he worked till to. Oh, so, okay. so just try it or Wait. go to local court. If it can be worked out, otherwise we'll decide on merits. Please. Please. Suggestion was to the effect. I kindly see uh, just a minute. Lord, so far kindly see the Lord the computation. Yeah. Lord, last time my learned friend was objecting to the penalty. I am saying so far as penalty part is concerned, though it is a mandatory, my will leave 
leave it to the honorable court it's 50% i say whatever honorable court suggests i am ready to accept very good you should just give your acceptance rejection there yes yes yeah. then <laughs> that we can be settled our efforts yeah. that Next. can be settled instantly. mainly a poor man wants something but Oh, no, all the four, all the four uh, workmen, they totally lost their full scheme. Akha Sharir no bad, do jakhu chamri utri gyo, and four of them expired. But it requires a sympathy. Why you are counting the days? And that is also misconceived. You go to Up to 2014, I was on the treatment. Okay. Report to Lugadala. Right. Yeah. 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 Okay. We'll we'll put our efforts. Yes. Okay. Uh, Singer number two, three, Yes. Yes. Unserved expired. expired. That is for some time. Time granted August may they do. Art August. As a last chance. As a last chance, you are granted time. It is 2019 matter. You are number 15. In view of the sick note filed by so and so, eighth of August. Which is in a time time granted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Separate board one two three. Ah, uh, separate board. Yes, per code board. Per code board. One, it's two, a, it's okay. okay. Yes, you file the AIDS application. Just in delay. Uh, per per code, no? Yes, ma'am. One, two, three is in this case. In this case, ma'am. Step number one. Yes, nine, yes, yes. Fifty-two. Uh, me dikte na. Fifty-two ka. Uh, ye jo per code board one, two, three hai. Usme uh, CA number one of 2022 is allowed. There is a uh, the CA number two is for delay in uh, bringing it. So, CA number two is allowed. Uh, delay uh, or so and so combination of uh, sufficient causes made out. Delay is combo. Then, what is the CA number one of 2022? Uh, delay is combo. Then, what is the CA number one of 2022? The legal errors are uh, directed to be brought on the board. Amendment be carried out accordingly. The first standard. Or uske baad number three, uh, CA number three of 2022 in view of the uh, disposal of CA number two of 2022 and CA number one of 2022. CA number three of 2022 is allowed. Abatement is set aside. Uh, or uh, उसके बाद ये इसमें अभी अभी जो ये है 52 में राइट दैट हमारा डिले कितना हो जाए 514 514 514 514 नहीं पर हमारा नोटिस इशू कर दिया ये सर रूल में भी इशू रूल इज इशू रूल रूल भी इशू रूल इशू रूल तू रिस्पार तू द लीगल एज ऑफ डिसीज Respondent number two, returnable on eighth of uh, eighth of August. So per court board ke three more dispose of hoga. My or is me. Okay. Ah? Ah, one not residing. You have provided fresh address. Emma expired. I will say fifty-three. Yes, fifty-three. Yes. 
is show her the note. So he has expired it. 53, Jana. You write that uh, as per the office note. Respondent number one uh, but has expired. Full stop. The learned EGP is directed to take appropriate steps with respect to bringing on record the legal age of respondent number one. Time is granted 2nd of August. SO2, 2nd of August. Student number 54 contributed as rule seven. How much is the delay? Delay is uh, 628 days. Pundo. I know. Pundo, first appeal admit. First appeal may order kar dena. Admit kar ke. Okay, first appeal awa do stay saathe asse na. First appeal. There must be some application for stay also. Okay, first appeal admit. Who stay ka? Jare house hai jare kar. Hi. For stay. Thik. This is disposed of. Uh, 54 ka. CA number 190 is disposed of. उसका बोर्ड बनाना पड़ेगा फर्स्ट अपील में। How much delay? Two twenty five days. Delay कौन दोन? फर्स्ट अपील एडमिट करो। टैग इसकी फर्स्ट अपील वन टू थ्री फोर अप ट्वेंटी वन। Tag along with tag along with one two three four. Yes, of twenty. Of twenty. One. Twenty twenty. Twenty one. Twenty twenty one. Yes. Here also filing number. Huh? Here also filing number. Earlier my application also filing number. Filing number. Yes, my. So that is stamp number. Stamp number of the high court. That so it will have to be converted now. Yes, my. Once the first appeal is admitted, it will be converted. That is what I am saying. Well, it's here. We have supplied necessary documents in the month of January, 20, uh, December 2021. Yes, we have supplied necessary documents, my lord, if the necessary application. Just next time I will see the application. As a last chance, time is granted to the learned AGP to file an appropriate application for bringing on record the legal use of respondent number one, expired respondent number one, SO228. Thank you. Time, uh, praise for time granted. SO2, do art for them. Do art, yeah. Two eight. Second of August. Yes, sir. In view of the leave notes filed by Mr. Misuraj Meena, SO2 28-7, the learned counsel in the meanwhile is directed to, it is directed to take appropriate steps with respect to unserved respondents. Fifty-three Jana. You are for? You have to take steps. 
with respect to conserved respondent number 7 8 12 to 15 and 16 and main contesting parties are been served this is uh, we have claim for order 7 rule 11 for rejection of claim maybe but once they are parties you have to serve them you may serve them through lower court whatever you take direct service serve them you want direct service any okay just write that uh, the learned counsel for the applicant is directed to take fresh steps with respect to unserved respondents 7 8 12 to 15 and 16 as per the office of the lord okay so to uh, 297. Number 63 to 65, one unsolved expert response. 63 and 64, not 65. Mm -hmm. 63 and 64, mother. I need some time to put on record. Legal. Well, I think there's a time to take steps for unsolved expert response. Freeze for time, time granted. This go gardo art art. Dono. 8th of August. My Lord. And next matter, my Lord. 65. Uh, yeah, we have we have already filed. We have already filed 65. 65, we have now, filed, but it is not on record. No, not on record. We have already. Uh, 65, uh, Mr. Manraj Varot Ranad AGP submits that. An application for bringing on record the legal heirs of the deceased respondent has already been filed. When it is filed, here I just inform that. Yes, uh, on tomorrow, my we will file on tomorrow because the affidavit is Achha, has a, that uh, is awesome. Uh, yes, yes, thank the you. Application, uh, the application will be uh, the application to bring on record the legal age of the unserved. This is for 65, right? Yes, ma'am. Uh, will be filed uh, during the course of the week, full stop. Michael. So, too. We can have it on, uh, we can have it at the shorter date then. Put it on uh, 13 7. Uh, in view of the signal filed by Ms. Meeta is Panchar. So, to Three eight. In the meantime, the learned advocate for the applicant is directed to uh, take appropriate steps for in the appropriate steps in respect of respondent number forty nine who has expired. Hey, this is for years only. This was for years only. Just show the file. Take me now. Unserved expert. Okay, yeah, you order the SO two three eight like there. T not here, why not?
नेक्स्ट कौन नोट कर लो बट ही इज ऑन सिक नोट एडवोकेट फॉर दी फॉर एपल एस ओ टू ट्वेल्व सेवन Here I have instructed to appear on behalf of the appellant, since the advocate of the appellants have been expired, Mr. Yes. So I'm paying for time for three weeks, Mr. To get all the papers, Mr. Mr. Jaki Lakhi Chand, please, Mr. Learned advocate submits that he has received instructions to appear on behalf of the appellant in uh, appellant. And prays for some time. You have filed your work, sir. No, sir. I I I may be permitted to file. Okay. Time has prayed for is granted to do the needful. Three weeks time maybe. Yes. I'll I'll give a date just a moment. Third of August. Please, ma'am. Great foot. Yes, sir. My lord, sir. Serial number sixty nine. We are from the respondent side. Uh, we have urgency in this matter, my lord. So I am requesting a shorter date. It is not possible. Or you, uh, what is the matter? It is coming up for stay only. Yes, yes, my lord. If possible, my my lord, if uh, it kept on July. You want in July? Twenty-six July, sir. Please, sir. Okay, my lord. Sir. Appeal is dismissed. No doubt. Lord, here the appeal is admitted. Yes. By my Lord Justice Vita. Oh. Yes. And my Lord, the we have already deposited the amount, and on our amount the stay is also granted. Now the rule is returnable. Rule is made returnable. Uh, stay for uh, stay of the uh, who is for the other side? No, Mr. Sir. You said that the certain is fine. I don't know. Pass it to Will. We meet at two thirty. Let it go. I am having one matter at two thirty. I have to go there. It's so only for confirmation. In confirmation, yeah. Mister Nikun will be here. Yes, let him go. Rab. Two thirty will. Very good. Your presence will mark it. Thank you. Sir. Seventy-three, Mr. Rupesh, and Mr. Rupesh, Mr. Jayakumar, Mr. Seventy-three and seventy-four are same, Lord. <coughs> Requesting for some accommodation. I had to extend it. There is. Uh, you are appearing for. I am for a respondent. A respondent. Lordship. There is unserved. This uh, rule is unserved. With respect to our. He may not have filed. He may not have filed the direct service affidavit. Otherwise, my lord. Our, one uh, one and two are served. No, they are not found at uh, the identified or there is an incomplete address. Something. To best of my knowledge, my lord, there are only two respondent to whom I represent. My lord. Only two respondent. Two respondent. So uh, you did. Show me the file. Show me. You appear for both the respondents. Lost ship. Right? Uh, that is uh, okay. Association and the secretary. Lost ship. Right? It is submitted that uh, Mr. J. F. Mehta appears for both the respondents in the matter. The service is complete. You are seeking some time. Please. Yes. Yes. Uh, you inform, but Mr. Desai. I have already informed. Okay. I will inform you, Lord. There is IA to be that is to be extended Lord. in both seventy uh, three and seventy four. Uh, Mr. Uh, Meta, please for some time, which is not objected to by. Uh, sorry, वो लिखा ना first. Please for some time. S O two. Uh, we'll keep it on fourth August. Uh, interim relief is extended till the next. Lost ship. Lost ship.
in both cases both the matter 73 and 74 Five, Mr. Kings the stay has been granted and the main uh, matter so first of all has been admitted and uh, the, uh, as in, uh, in we have deposited the amount as per the this is land acquisition please your lordships we have deposited the amount as per the court you deposited. please your lordships now what is to be done then they are served think, no? it seems it is for the confirmation no one is appearing it is already admitted please your lordships it seems it is for the confirmation of the payment made we have made the payment no? may, may i send i mean may i please for your lordship's perusal mr divedi learned advocate appearing on behalf of the appellant submits that in terms of the order dated 12 4 2022 the amount the amount has already been deposited the entire decretal amount has already please been deposited lordship. in the trial court in the trial court this is so no rule is so please please your lordship in the present matter the rule uh, you write further in the present matter the rule is so however none appears for the claimant please your lordship respondent claimant uh add in trim really uh, ca number uh, one may lick na ca number two uh, sorry ca number two of 2019 you see me that uh, add in trim relief granted on 12 4 2022 is confirmed till the final disposal of the first appeal in the meanwhile the Claimant respondent is permitted to withdraw fifty percent. What is the total amount here? Forty forty thousand. Huh? Forty thousand. Forty thousand. Forty thousand. Along with the interest and that uh, compensation. Only forty thousand. Please, your lordship. What is to be challenged here in view of the government order? This has to be disposed of. Please, your lordship. In view of the notification, you give that notification. It is disposed of. Please, also, I also provide the copy. Due to smallness of amount, this is dismissed. Sorry, hata do, sara likh do ke. In view of the quantum of the small quantum of amount. The first appeal stands dismissed. No order on merits. Not to be treated as a precedent. Dismissed. Yes. Lordship. Lordship. No, no. Only in view of the small quantum of amount. Civil application does not authorize. Nothing, sir. It is disposed of. First appeal is disposed of. Sir, what are those? First appeal disposed. Of. What for forty thousand? You should advise your clients. <laughs> this is a real estate pattern. Then you should tell the court. Railway department doesn't Railway matter, department. but 40,000 is nothing. Okay, I'll pass that order that it is disposed of in terms of quantum of the amount. Yes. But you give the exact amount. What is the amount which you have deposited right now? You had given that. It is a copy of the demand draft. Ah, but that is the amount. 42,000. 42,000. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Who amount like that? Who? Ah, here. Abhi parso order pass kiya hai. Inke matter mein. State ke matter mein. Ah, ke. se pat. Iske koshik ke pas. Kedi to hamke pas mein jaaye. Dismissed. Dismissed. Ah, dispo. Ah, dismissed. Right. Dismissed. First appeal is dismissed, na? Huh? It's government would be the contesting party. All it is against the RNB department. You see construction of by the manager bank of Baroda Mile. Seventy six. Yes, my lord. Oh, I'm sorry. One of the parties, Bank of Baroda Nasik Devla Libranch. Rule is not received back with respect to whom? Because him, I don't know. This is an endorsement. Rule is not received back.
So one is there. Two, three, four, so. So five would be the bank. So everybody is served. Yes. You want you you want to take some time or you are making no 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 my dear. I don't have they ask for the stay uh, confirmation. Ah, so it will be confirmed. It has been operating yes. since 2015. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, my dear. That is what. Uh, my dear, may kindly see page number 10, 27, sir. The prayer clause. Prayer clause. Page 10. Yes. Yes. What do you want to do? No, no. I am just uh, reading the prayer. Prayer of the applicant. Hmm. Your Lordship, please to grant a status quo in respect of FPR amount 19,78,600 with the account number so and so and direct to respond number 5 not to release the FPR. Hmm. This is the stay. Yes. So 50% maybe. This is already done in the last. The earlier uh, Honorable Court had already granted. Considered all these things. Please. In that case, in that case. And take in view of that only the appeal is admitted. I so know. just uh, they ask the CA, it's, it's only CA. It's only one. CA. Yes, yes. Ah. yes. You write all the parties CA are served. Uh, the interim relief at interim the interim relief granted in uh, granted in uh, in terms of the order dated 29-4-2022 is confirmed till the final disposal of the I am grateful. Okay. CA is disposed. Number seventeen seven. Ashura, may I request for short accommodation? I am on. You are appearing on behalf for of petitioners, applicants. Mr. Vagel, yes, sir. You are Mr. Vagel. Yes, sir. Phone number. Twenty. Yeah. Seven eleven applicant. You are for. I am for the phone number one. One and she is for. In one there is uh, there are some papers instructions I have called from client. There is one okay, no that problem. Is, and uh, one more Mr. Harsh Vagela, learned advocate on behalf of the applicant, prays for some time. The respondents have no objection towards the same. Prays for some time. So two. You write so two. Okay, no problem. So two. 28 7. I have no objection. I have no objection. You have no objection. Right. The advocates for the respondents have no objection. SO2 28 7. 28 7. Please your attention. Even say 80, Mr. There is. I appear with Mr. Vargas. Okay, that's what I have. <laughs> yes. As such, the matter is arising out of Order 7 Rule 11 application, hmm. which is rejected by the court on the strength of the order passed below Exhibit 5. So, as such, the court has not gone into the scope of Order 7 Rule 11, but has indirectly applied the principles of Exhibit 5, saying that since I have lost in Exhibit 5, so I am rejecting Exhibit's, uh, this application. Now may I give the findings, my just what revealed with the court? Just a moment, just a moment. Even the first order which is passed. That's what I, the same contention in the case. So I was requesting it can be remanded, subject to what my learned friend has to point out. Because the court has not gone on to the finding as to why it is rejected under Order 7 and 11. Show me the finding. Uh, page 14, my lords. Page 14? Uh, page, okay, says, yes, yes. page 13 is paragraph 4, correct, so I don't correct. have to read again. Correct. I'll read para 4 and 5, my lords. Yes. Now, crucial and substantial question arises before this court for determination of the present application is that whether it would be sufficient to say by the plaintiff that the defendant was behaving in such manner which may violate or disturb entire object of the contract 
or the defendant was not ready and willing to execute register sale deed though the plaintiff was ready and willing to pay outstanding amount but this is on merits because in present suit recording of the evidence is going to be start after decision of this application so in absence of any evidence there is only averment available on record by the plaintiff that the defendant's conduct was it was itself left the plaintiff with no choice rather than to bring this suit this is the reason on the other hand now kindly see on the other hand it clearly appears that last date of performance of the contract was 2nd august and the plaintiff has filed this suit before expiry of the last date i said there was no cause of action therefore undoubtedly this suit is premature but here this court has to decide whether such premature leads this court to dismiss the suit or not in other words whether such prematurity is sufficient to believe that there is no cause of action came into existence what was the last date 2nd august 17 and the suit was filed on? prior there to uh, no, no, suit prior was means how many 15 days? june 16 how many days prior to uh, a year and uh, this was a second august 17 last date of performance of the contract was second august just Seven, uh, second august 17 but kindly uh, see the contract page 27 yes the yes. balance last three lines તેમજ અવેજ પેટેની બાકી રહેતી રકમ 10 લાખ પૂરા 2 8 70 સુધી ચૂકવી આપે ત્યારે તમોને અથવા તમો કોહો તેનો દસ્તાવેજ કરી આપવાનો સો બિફોર 2nd ઓગસ્ટ 17 આઈ વોઝ નોટ રિક્વાયર્ડ ટુ ડુ એનીથિંગ એટ ધ મોસ્ટ હી કુડ હેવ ગિવન નોટિસ ટુ મી देयर ઇઝ નો નોટિસ ગિવન બટ સ્ટેટ અવે સુટ ઇઝ ફાઇલ્ડ ધ સુટ ઇઝ ફાઇલ્ડ માઇનસ ધ પ્લેન્ટ ઇઝ એટ પેજ નંબર 23 15th જૂન 17 હા 15th જૂન 17 યસ so apart from that the court doesn't go further kindly see what the court appealed my lords kindly see further i so now what is the stage before the trial court my it is pending no no because the evidence the, has been recorded or? no 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 the person had expired my lords the legal heirs were brought on record and thereafter it was covid so it had not proceeded and my lord kindly see page so you want remand for my kindly see page 5 uh, paragraph 5 now what court on merits went ahead in this context it would be profitable to consider order passed by the court below an application for interim injunction at exhibit 5 it transpires that this court has wide its order passed below an application for interim injunction partly allowed the application of the plaintiff for interim injunction and prevented the defendant from selling or transferring or assigning the suit property to anybody else directly or indirectly during the pendency therefore wide order this court has firmly believed that the plaintiff has a prima facie case in this case while this court has after hearing on merit constituted its opinion the plaintiff has prima facie case and after considering prima facie his court has granted injunction in favor of the plaintiff to prevent the defendant now from now whether now this was passed in 2019 right yes now whether the, the that was performed or not no minus now the suit is it is subjudice so without suppose i do certain act it will harm the contention in the suit So ultimately, it has gone on the footing of Exhibit Five, the whole order. So I was suggesting okay. let the application be reheard without going into the merits. What do you? Think? It can give opinion on merits. Okay. Otherwise, there's no merit. The client court has uh, hmm. rejected the application. This is one of the ground. But Melod's may kindly see that outer limit, the date. Melod, that it is not that on that day or after that I have to make the payment. No, no. Melod, till that, within, it, till that mm-hmm. date, you will have to wait at least. No, Melod's may I Melod suppose Melod's may kindly see that date is about six months period is given. That within six months I have to make the payment. Melod's may kindly see Melod if within three months I have the amount and I am asking him to. That is a different issue. Then the notice no, has no. to be there. There is no notice also. So the state of no, the no, suit is yeah, there. What you say is right, Mr. Gandhi. Right. No issue on that. But the thing is that. the suit is if, even if you even if you issue a notice before that and he says that i, I will, will make a payment or i will act by two no, 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 days no, i have to sorry, execute no, no. a sale make the payment melots may have to make the payment or whatever the transaction melots whatever the transaction melot there is a period, outer limit of 6 months i have to make the payment within 6 months and he has to execute the sale day sale day melot if within 2 months i have amount and i am asking him to execute the sale date and he denies then my lord certainly cause of action arises but where is that therefore my lord i i need not to okay. wait for okay. it doesn't lord. matter but uh, ultimately without my recording uh, i mean without my consent recording is my likh lena is my likh lena 
that it is submitted uh, that this code had uh, had passed the following order on 24/7/2019. ये order code कर ठीक है uh, उसके बाद लिख देना today the matter has come up for hearing when this court is of the opinion that the application on order under order 7 rule 11 is required to be heard and decided on merits in view of the observations made of the observations made by the learned trial court in para 4 and 5 of the impugned order accordingly the impugned order is set aside and the application under order 7 rule 11 is directed to be heard afresh without getting influence of the heard afresh uh heard afresh on merits to so stop the said application may be decided within a period of 3 months from today please on 3 months from the date of the receipt of the order please the present civil revision application is disposed of according without one more objection without without influence by the earlier order and without, the order without, of order of without order without order. without uh, without uh, uh, influence by the without taking into consideration the interim order at under exhibit five. please and, and the order passed by this court no order i'm not I, I, uh, no, no, it is made clear that uh, it is made clear that uh, uh, the applic uh, the uh, applic uh, the application under order uh, no this this court has not uh, Uh, not uh, this court has not gone into the merits of the case please on order 7 rule 11 application ah, on please. order 7 rule 11 please Think this was the okay this was 18 na 8 this court i'll give the appeal bimal patel yes, with yes. mr harshwaj please make a mention 230 230 30. Today mentioning that two thirty. <laughs> the court is only till three o'clock. Yes. Okay.
May I mention that matter at item number 88, Milord, I'm requesting uh, Mr. Uh, Hari Brahmbar has filed a leave note. I am informed. Right. Uh, Milord, uh, may I request for a short date? The reason is that the suit out of which this CRA arises, it arises out of non rejection of 7 11. I am for the original plaintiff. That suit is withdrawn. Suit is withdrawn. So, so this, this is, is to be disposed of effectively. Any short date, Milord, when Mr. Janil. We can give it tomorrow. Please, Your Lord. No, but uh, I don't know whether Janil Chai is there. Janil Shah is there, he's not available today, may not, but may I request for Monday in that case, Okay, Monday. We'll we'll mention and we'll remind you a lot. Okay. Yes. Uh, the list on uh, Monday is what day? No, 27th. Oh, like, so, yes. Uh, I'll mention on behalf of Mr. Speak request is not time with joint request. Another side is here or not? Thank you. By consent, SO2.
In the morning, sir, my lord have issued yes. a notice to the respondents. Uh, my request is for my request for a direct service. Direct service permitted. Oblige. Sir. With consent, you are Mr. Ajay, you are there, Mr. Trivedi. By consent, so to second August. The another request for sale for one zero five. One zero five. Yes. But other side, you are informed. I have dropped a message, but before it. One hundred and five. It's already at the. Wait. Two twenty-eight seven noted down. They were faster than you. Okay. Yeah, mentioned the lottery. Either number one twenty-six. I'm getting one lot of Mister Dawan. One twenty-six. Please, sir. But if the matter is not called out, let them request any shortage. It will not be called out. Will not any shortage be at some other place? One twenty-six. Please, sir. This is a land acquisition or something? No, no, this is by railway. Yes, it's a railway. That's why I asked you whether it's acquisition or some uh, what you can say contract or something. No, no, this is by railway. Okay, nineteen nineteen seven. 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 With joint request, I am requesting for time allots. One zero seven. One zero seven. Yes, allots. The matter is arising from the work of act allots. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Ah. Yeah. One zero seven. You are on behalf of Mr. Manan Bhat. I am on behalf of Mr. Shailar. Mr. Shailar, this is you are for Shailar. Yes, Shailar. Okay. You want time? Allots. Actually, he wants time. Okay. This is regarding what? Work of fact, my lord. So he, here the issue is of tenancy. I claim that I am a original tenant, uh, residing since nineteen sixty-three. They are for the work. They are for uh, for the uh, the mosque. The it is not on board, my lord. No, it will not be next week. It will go in third week of July or something like. Twenty second July, Millard's ad interim relief may be extended. I hear to be extended till the next date of hearing. Millard's another request serial number hundred and thirteen. Millard's hundred hundred and thirteen. One one three. One one three. Millard's here. Millard's the other side has filed a seek note today. Arsh Kajja. Yes, Millard's any date. Millard's Millard's here also. Th there is a ad interim relief. Millard's here that uh, there is one who is who is unsold expired. Millard's we have uh, we have uh, we are awaiting. For the details, Millards. <clears throat> In view of the signal filed by Mr. Harsh Vigajar, SO two, third of August. In the meanwhile, the advocate for the appellant is directed to take necessary steps to. In respect of respondent, uh, in respect of expired unserved respondent number three. Ad interim relief may be extended. Sir. I have to continue till the next date of hearing. Today it is not possible. Today the court is only till three o'clock. One twenty nine. We can. Eleventh okay. is not possible. It's only after twenty July. Was what the twenty first, twenty second? What do you mean? Twenty first, twenty first of July. At the request of Miss Hina Desai, the matter was right. Right, but that's okay. Twenty one. Sir, much more mention. Answer number one thirty. One three zero. Supply of paper books. So, uh, requesting for one week time. 
your own behalf of uh, on behalf of mr nilesh pandya mr nilesh mr nilesh pandya you are for respondent yes for the respondent you want to what do you want to file a paper for yes. at the request of mr nilesh pandya learned advocate for respondent so to 4th of august Now appears on the second call in the interest of justice for the purpose. So to go. You are there. Ah. Lord, she just can we see the compilation? Only on the one issue because to demolish the case of the original plenty, that paragraph two, which I read on the first part. Let the tenant leave and license executed in two, a, August two thousand nine. This so, is para seven years. Lots of places. So therefore, according to the original plaintiff, the tenancy property has been given to the present appellant only in the August two thousand nine. Okay, where is it? Uh, in the compilation, lots of page number one. It is the copy of the plain. Yes. And the relevant at yes, page yes, two, yes. paragraph four. Okay. Now, lots of kindly look at the documents which I have produced. In the compilation, with that copy of the plaint, along with that, I have produced a couple of documents. Lord, she just kindly look at page hundred and fifteen onwards. Yes. Yes. In a minute, Lord. Or you just kindly see the page hundred and fifteen. That's my election commission card. Mm. In the name they say, Arjun will use the appellant before a lordship. Mm. Lordship, just kindly have look at the address. C one zero two, which is the subject matter of the property, and kindly have look at the date and the year at the bottom of that page. I mean the printed portion. Date is twentieth April two thousand seven. Now, if the tenant given license given only in August two thousand nine, how am I supposed to able to get According this? According to you, you are put in possession on what? Prior date? to that, what date? On two thousand seven, Lord Chief. No, no, what date? Date in a minute, Lord Chief. What is your? Uh, yes, yes, in a minute, Lord Chief. Lordship in two thousand nine. Lordship just can you page triple one because date is not there, so that I can't into my case. Whatever it is in the plain, then I'll able to assist the court. Page triple one, paragraph one of the my plain suit of two thousand nine. Lordship. Amo vadi na asre panch vas sadao masik rupee ek hazar pura na bada thi. Lek bani aaj chuna aki na kade bada apne rich. So suit filed in two thousand nine. So at the base, the case of the present appellant that from in two thousand four, the pro property has been given on the rent. This is your suit. Yes, my suit. But it is in two thousand nine. I filed in two thousand nine. I am. I am not on the year of the suit. No, you said you had filed the suit in two thousand seven. No, 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 no. I filed in two thousand nine, and I produced the documents which shows that my actual the possessions, which is with me, at least from two thousand seven. Therefore, I have taken the court that page one hundred and fifteen. Correct. So this is the government documents which I obtained. Now, therefore, just to match this page one hundred and fifteen with the government's made in paragraph three. Paragraph 
seven of the plaint that in August two thousand nine, legal license agreement executed for one month. I let out the premises to the present appellant. That case is demolished on looking to this document. Good, Mr. Jair Shah. Will be advocate for the appellant. He submits that the perusal of the averments in para three of the suit states that the suit property was given on leave. Notice I am issuing notice. Is oh, you are. That's what I asked. You said no, no. no. Okay. I thought you said no, no, no. I asked you. <laughs> no, no. Then you why... please make a argument. I thought nobody is there on the list. Yes, please, please. I was simply issuing notice. Well, the notice was issued under Act. No, you are on KVF. I think it was on KVF. You are on KVF. It is on KVF. KVF. See, what do you have to say about his possession being in prior? Like half-hearted, well, submissions on part of the appellant. Yeah, yeah. What is transpired? I filed it under the last leave and last agreement that the period is over. That is not disputed. Eh? During the proceedings of the suit, we filed. An application for the real estate and next property that came to be allowed. They challenged it before this honorable court, which came to be dismissed. The Lord, meanwhile, they also preferred an application to take the written statement on record. That written statement was permitted to be taken on record allowed. No, written statement was no, no. Yes, it was taken. Okay. Because you okay. might should it is that written statement. Okay. <clears throat> that written statement permitted to be taken on record. But as you know, they failed to pay the various of rights as directed by the right court and confirmed by this honorable court. We gave an application to strip off the witness. That application came to be allowed. So that defense, Lord, technically, legally, Lord, is not sustainable now in any case. That order is not challenged. So the defense, whatever they have taken in the written statement, until and otherwise that order is been Lord set aside, is not available. But thereafter, trial proceeded. Decrease pass in my view. Till the date, not a single rupee has been paid by way of a rank. He is enjoying, my lord, the position since whatever he says, my lord, 2007-2009, whatever I say. The man's profit is granted from the date of license, my lord. It is not from prior there too. But you have uh, you have not paid the amount now. You have paid today, my lord. You paid eight lakhs and more by now. Therefore, I make this. So you you first deposit then first the deposit me lot then we will at least in the first part also I made the statement it is not only the memo of the but in the civil application also I made the statement on it because memo is always signed by the advocate civil application therefore I use the word civil application in that also I made the statement I am conscious about the fact that without paying the areas there is no point in making any sort of state also the civil application I will find. Civil application for uh, because there is a judgment and decree to, for the stay against the judgment and decree. I find it civil application action. See, ha. In view of the averments made in the civil application number one of twenty twenty two, you have seen that application. I have seen. See, we will ask him that uh, the the appellant is uh, directed to deposit. The entire arrears. May I give the period, Lord? Just to the entire arrears of. No, I give the period so that yes. there should not be dispute later on. As per the order of the court. No, no. First order for the next. As per the order of the court. Okay, first. You just check first August two thousand eight till thirty first. From from first August two thousand eight 
till 31st May 2022. 31st May 2022. Which covers the last month. Today we are in June. So therefore, full stop. At the rate of 5,000. Because that is the order that of the order. order. At the rate of 5,000 per month as directed by the learned trial. So within a period of? What she packs. Instruction to make the request for eight weeks. But I know that it is true. Because it's even eight weeks, it doesn't matter. Because it will run in eight, eight, eight legs. No, no, if, and no, no, no. In addition to that, what's it? One more. If it doesn't do within eight weeks, we'll keep it in August. It will no, be or not. It will be. May I request that? And in addition to deposit per month also from the next month, from the June also. Record my statement, I'll deposit 5,000. I mean, you, you have written that you will be deposit, willing to no. deposit till the pendency of the. No, no, correct, Lord Chief. That is what you have written. So actually, you have without say, but Lord Chief. But every month, that I have your own statement. To, otherwise, there, there is another. And, and he will, he will, he will continue to deposit the said rent every month at the rate of five thousand. So there's the order. Ah, at the rate of five thousand per month, Lord Chief. You have written here in. Para 6 that the applicant is ready and willing to deposit entire areas as also ready and willing to pay per month 5000 till the disposal of the fee. Well, that is your own and that's what I saw. No, therefore, I said so because it with has to be way. part of the order. Nothing like right. with the liberty to withdraw them. I should have a liberty to withdraw. Let him deposit you withdraw them. No, I'm not about withdrawing. I should not have a liberty to make appropriate application based, based on a good culture and then spend that out. Because there is now that, Supreme Court judgment. See, see that liberty you don't require, you can always file. Okay. But this is trial court's order. This is that. So therefore, you will have to file a separate CR if you want that enhancement of rent. No, we are not. Therefore, I am saying that there is a Supreme Court judgment. I can make an application before this honorable court suggesting that there is to be enhanced. Correct. Correct. Then you, that you either a CRA or an application, whatever. Huh. Pending in the CRA, I can file. Lordship, with this order, may I have the liberty to make it? Now, huh, uh, within a period of what? Week? Eight weeks, Lordship. Various. Within a period of eight weeks from today. It will come to today's 23rd, right? By Eighteenth August. Plus some amount on or before something. Otherwise, he will enjoy another eight weeks, and if he don't pay me lot again for eight weeks, me lot uh, again this proceeding. No, he, he is undertaking. He, no, is, he is undertaking the land. There is some condition that he should be paid because it's twenty five, fifty percent within three weeks, four weeks, whatever it is. Okay, uh, within a period of forty eight, uh, eight weeks. Full stop. Uh, fifty percent of the arrears shall be deposited within a period of four weeks and 50 rest 50 percent will be deposited uh, in the another in the period. next four weeks okay. so to 18th of august not in that case may i deliver you make the request on the cs paragraph 7a launching no 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 i'm not issuing notice sir. no no but he is appearing on KBS doesn't launching. matter still he will not precipitate well, the thing. Till today we are not filing any precipitation today. Till today we are not filing. No, no. no, no we will we'll, we'll take that decision once you deposit. Not. Well, you have to first deposit and. Uh, no, uh, no difficulty. No uh, difficulty. Thereafter we will. Thereafter, thereafter we will definitely consider. Right. I hope that. Sure. Okay. Eighteenth of August. Just a moment. This was what item? 14? 14. 14. 14. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's my subject. Do accept it is arrears. It is arrears. Subject to my right of contention in this year. It is arrears. Deposit of bank account. Otherwise, you know, I am entitled I am, to. I am, not, I am not issued. Yes, also, I am not doing anything. I am just saying that he is directed to deposit. The, 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 the moment he will deposit, he may contest that. My no, no. Right thereafter, he will be heard. That's all. My, my thereafter, right he will be heard. Thereafter, yes. you will be heard for issuance yes. of notice. Because there is a well, order, and stay. The order of this honorable court, you know, 
they have not complied with the first period. Now, now that's what we are. That's why it may not be waiver on my part. That's no, no, it point. is not a waiver no. on me. It is not your waiver on your part. Neither no. there is a consent on me. Yes. Serial number 72, Mr. Vipu, your hour, Mr. Pages, Peter, sir. Lord Sikh, on behalf of Mr. Sutta, I am uh, mentioned that Lord Sikh, our name is already deleted. Uh, yeah, yes. In the morning, you are deleted. Yes. Just the uh, on the order oh, dated 5, 4, uh, 2020. This is which item number? It is submitted. My mm. learned advocate, Mr. Tejas P. Sarta, that is. He has already written the paper. Uh, lots of our name is deleted. Our name, uh, some who appears now. Uh, lots of in the order of uh, this honorable court, lots of uh, five, four, lots of. Yes, yes, yes. So, who has appeared on behalf of uh, Mr. Prachand Desai had appeared? It says. Anyway, the uh, in terms of the order dated 5 4 2022, the name of Mr. Tejas P. Sata, advocate for the respondent, has been has since been deleted. However, the registry has today also shown the name of Mr. Sata only. The registry is directed to delete the name of. Uh, Mr. Tejas P. Sattar from the array of the respondent, array of the uh, from the uh, to delete it the form. and the name of <coughs> new advocate who has filed and the name of uh, new advocate who has filed appearance on behalf of the respondent mm -hmm. may be shown I am on behalf of Mr. Nikun Rao. Uh, this is a CA for state. Uh, there but, was a conditional decree of the lower courts. The yes, uh, in this matter, they had appeared in the morning, I think. Yes, Your Lordship, but uh, uh, I have been instructed that uh, we have deposited the money, so the CA may be disposed of. No, CA, but nobody is appearing on the other side, therefore, I will not dispose it of. I will keep it on the next date. Okay. Yes. That is already there. That order is there. It was for confirmation, but now since we had adjourned it because they did not bring it to the notice that uh, his name was already deleted. Okay. We will uh, keep it on. Fifteen seven. Board continues. Just now. Wants to mention my eighty two next month. Eighty two. Yes. Here below there is a eviction decree in my program for this point. Two constant findings of the or oh, today it is not possible. But I'm saying when we during pendency of this year eviction proceeding was also going. We have already taken the position. You have taken the position. Who is appearing? Nobody is there. So let it go. But serial number 106. Yes. This, uh, after this may weeks, be kept 10 weeks. Now. This may be kept in the next week. So, uh, what item number you said? 106. 
106 they had uh, mr vaishya had in the morning he had mentioned the he's old uh, he's an aged person he had mentioned and uh, 3rd of august it was 120 You are for Mr. Bush. Or it can go only on twenty or twenty July. Still, there are too many matters on board. So we have ninety-five. Ninety-five. So we have ninety-five. Ninety-five. Lot. This is also a short point only. Rented shop of the trust, you know, and the stay is granted by the Soviet. Next one, subject to my laws or anything. Sorry, anything. It will go. I'll give you a date. Nineteen or twenty? What? Very. Nineteen. Lost. Nineteen. Nineteen. Good luck. This was one zero. No, sorry. Ninety-five. 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 Limited number. 